Okay, we are back and we should be good. Right, Boone? Boone? Are we good, Boone? I think we're good, right, Boone? Yeah, we're good, right, Boone? We're definitely good. Anyways. First things first. I wanted to... Kind of want to go to the vault, but the freaking gecko kicked my ass. So we're instead going to go to Camp McCarran. Right, Boone? With our new katana. Let's go. It says towards Camp McCarran, right? I kind of forgot. <laughs> I swear I'm walking slower because of the heavy armor. Isn't that right, Boone? You do have light armor. Some pretty strong light armor at that. Like, I think it's strong. I remember using all my playthroughs of this game, I used the Vault 13 armored suit, like the entire game. Oh, we found a new area. I'm not gonna bother with that. Are there people around here for me to talk to? Let me make it daytime. It's probably gonna starve me as well as make me thirsty. Uh oh, it made me thirsty. Are there people around here? Anyone home? Hi, Boone. No. Not many people here, despite this being a farm. Where the hell is everybody? Oh, do I get the flag? Oh, someone's in front of me. Where are you, buddy? I don't trust you. We won't go quiet. But you can count on it. Oh, I didn't, <laughs> I didn't mean to take the sword out. I'm not a recruitment officer. You want to join the army? I'm sure someone at McCarran can point you in the right direction. You tell me about the fields. Impressive, aren't they? <clears throat> Not really. Don't see anything like this outside of NCR territory, that's for sure. We get the water, clean water, pumped in from Lake Mead. If you follow the big pipes, they'll take you all the way to the lake. Okay. Why are the fields being guarded? That is a good question. A lot actually. of the crops grown here support the various NCR camps in the region. McCarran, Golf, and Forlorn Hope, to name a few. We can't have wastelanders popping in here for a free meal, so my squad and I are assigned to keep things from going to hell. Okay. So you're saying if you see anyone take food, you just shoot them down. That's kind of... Kind of fucked, dude. Do you have anything to say? It's been a long tour. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now yeah, yeah, yeah. Nuclear winter this, nuclear winter that. Mojave this, Mojave that. More money, more problems. I can't wait to get into New Vegas. I don't know why Boone is in these buildings before me every time. Also, what is the point of these rooms? Boone, you want a bucket? Want a bucket? Take the bucket. Why does no one want the bucket? I like the all there is to this place. I don't think there's anyone important here. Greenhouse door. Yeah, I don't think there's anything important here. I probably have to come here for like a quest. Okay, they had way more food than I thought they were growing. Now I see why they kind of want to defend it, but still, it's still fucked. Alright, here's McCarran. Let me drink something. My dirty water. There. I think the other the other thing that's taking up so much space in my bag is the water. Because it weighs I think a, a pound each. And obviously it's super important for me in this playthrough. Also, I still need grenade rifle ammo. What's in front of me right now? It's a group of people. Oh. The Glafferty's been riding asses again. Better lay low. The Crimson Caravan's the biggest merchant outfit in the wasteland. Can I not trade with you? Hey. The 
Lafferty's been right. Okay, well, never mind. Better lay low. What is this? With only going to freaking uh I forgot the name of the place. But with only going there and I'm freaking exploring crap. What's here? El Rey Motel. It's a single door I could get into. The other one's blocked. Who are you? Howdy. Alright. Two doors. Can't run from me. What is happening? <laughs> Alright, come here! This katana's pretty strong. Oh, this one's already dead. He's kind of adorable. Look at him. Baby Scorpion. Look at him. Here, you want some... What is that? You want some cram? Cram it up your mouth. Get it? Alright. Lava cap, fry grenade, sludge hammer. So why is there a room full of scorpions? Small burned book. Read threatening note. Your debt still remains unpaid. We have warned you twice. There will be not be a third warning, only consequences. You have one day. So you shoved a bunch of rat scorpions in his room while he was sleeping? Is that what you did? What is that? While he was eating noodles? Nuka-Cola, whiskey, meh. Alright. I wasn't expecting a hotel room full of scorpions and a dead body. Oh, a footlocker. And it's empty. Of course it's empty. Freaking locked door. Come on. Oh, I completed a challenge. Let's go. Ooh, and why? Okay, well, he was insane. Good job, Boone. Stop doing that. I'm trying to, like, turn on the light, but I keep opening the goddamn thing. Pre war casual wear. Leather belt. Knife. I thought I was here. Is the casual wear that rare? I don't think it is. It's a hat. Oh, there we go. That's what we wanted. So I don't know how many caps I needed for that quest, but I think I'm almost there since I actually stole caps this playthrough compared to the other times I played. Why is every room just full of death? Ooh. Nuka Cola Victory. I'll take that. You're talking about my boys that I sent to space. Wait, is that no bark? Yeah, that's that's no bark. I took an empty syringe now. Cocktail, it's all just fucking alcoholic drinks. Okay, well, guess that's all there is here. <gasps> my song! It's my song! I'm sad. Blue moon, you saw me standing alone, without a boon in my heart. Let's go, let's go. I want to get this done so we can go straight to New Vegas and start gambling. Cause I need money. Gambling is the only way I can think of to get money right now, so I need to get barter up. So what is the correct entrance to this building? I didn't go past it, did I? No. I think it is this way. Oh! There it is! The Sunset Sarsaparilla Factory! I kinda wanna go check it out after this, actually. I don't know if I have enough bottle caps. I don't know how much I need it, but... I, let me check how much I have. I don't even know. I think it's in that skirt. I have 24. I feel like I'm super close to having enough. I feel like it might even be 25. I don't know. Wait, how am I supposed to get in here? Boon, can you guide me? Can you be my guide, Boon? Something is gonna attack me. I already know it. 
I'm not used to there being quiet. I swear the door is that way and I just went past it. That was ominous. Okay. I am, it, the armor is making me walk slower. I mean, I like heavy armor, but if it's just gonna slow me down and make everything slower. Didn't I have something else? I sold it, didn't I? I did sell it. Stop doing that. My freaking controller's super sensitive. Fuck it. I'm sure we'll find some sort of medium armor somewhere, somehow. What's this? This is new. Okay, no, the entrance is definitely that way, and I ran past it. South Cistern? Patrolling the Mojave almost makes you wish for a nuclear winter. Can I kill her, Boone? Patrolling the Mojave almost. Oh makes my God! Okay. There's something quest related. Oh, agua. Oh, but it's radiated agua. Oh no. God damn it. Okay, no, I ran past the entrance. I know I ran past the entrance. About to freaking reach free side gate again. Can't be carrying his. Yeah, no, I went past the door. It's in front of the motel. Right? Right? Oh, that's lovely. Is this the door? Are you the door? No, you're not. I think it's near the, the farm. I'm hungry! Pacey lad. There we go. God fucking damn it. I and mean, I remember having this with trouble trying to enter this building. Am I... Am I high? Am I even able to enter this building from the outside? Am I about to loop around this whole building and not be able to go inside of it? Tell me right now, there's a single door I walked past. Greenhouse, greenhouse, greenhouse. It's a train track or monorail track, some sort of track. Does it connect to New Vegas? I think it does. I think it's... I think it is in New Vegas, isn't it? Cause that looks like... That looks like it's in the wall that's connected to New Vegas. I don't know. I think I'm just wasting a lot of time right now. Well, I said it's go deal with the... The gecko problem at the vault. See, I'm freaking looped back around. I'm now at. What is this? The gunrunners thing. Surprisingly, I've never been there even when I did an evil run. I wonder what's inside here. Okay, I did a giant loop. Let's go to freaking the vault. What would be co closer? I guess this would be closer. We also gotta go back. We also gotta go back and freaking. Uh... Oh wait, no. We should go in here first. We should go back and deal with the giant rats that one shot at me back when we first started playing. <laughs> the rodents of unusual size. I think it's what they call. I hear a troublesome legion camp got raised to the ground. Yeah, it's because of me and Boom. Oh, stop doing that. Oh, hello. What can I do for you? Who are you? My name's Frank Weathers. I'm a farmer. Got a few hundred acres near Junktown. Well, I was a farmer. I guess I'm not much of anything now. Why come all the way to New Vegas? Why does anybody? 
I thought I'd strike it rich at the tables, of make my fortune, and never have to plow those damn fields again. I just wanted to provide for my family, and now they're gone. All gone. Jesus, dude, what the hell God happened? Forgive me. What happened to them? We were crossing the Mojave, not far from Searchlight, when a band of Caesar's Legion slavers came out of nowhere. They took my family. Wait a minute. Why didn't they take you too? I... God help me. I ran. I abandoned my family to those butchers. Wow. Not a day goes by. I don't hate myself for that. And I ran. Wow, it's a protector you turn out to be. They would have killed you if you fought. Maybe I could help you find them. You do that for a complete stranger? Thank you, my friend. The army says they don't have the available manpower, as if the city is more important. From what I've gathered from NCR Rangers, they were most likely taken to Cottonwood Cove. You might start there. You mean the whole giant base of Caesar's Legion? They're cannibals, slavers, and worse. I hear rumors they're poised to overrun the entire Colorado River Valley, and even the army won't be enough to stop them. One of the officers here, or Camp McCarran, might be able to tell you more. I don't know. That, that's going to involve me to go into an entire Legion camp that hates me. If I get attacked by another raider group, oh, another raid group of them, I can disguise myself. We the Legion being wiped out at Nelson gave us some breathing room. Hopefully the brass will use that. You're welcome. What is this place? This here's where folks go when their luck runs out. Drifters up from the Republic, locals that can't turn a dime, drunken reprobates from all around. That's all reprobate. And if you don't have the caps to get onto the strip, odds are you'll end up here. Sounds like a chaotic place. Is there any way I could help? Well, I am a little short-staffed. Maybe you could give me a hand. That's some all I have. have gone missing from the camp lately. I haven't seen any signs of violence or heard about any feuds. They just up and vanished. And I've also got Keith and his gambling to Keith. deal with. I know that skunk's cheating folk out of their savings. I just can't prove it. Tell me about the missing people. They never seem to have much in common. That's why I didn't notice it sooner. Young folks, old folks, men, women, all disappearing. I remember a family with a little blonde girl. She never talked much. But she always carried this little stuffed teddy bear. Can you remember anything else? Seem to recall a lot of them did business with those scavengers over on the west side. Dermot and St. James. Tell you about this Keith. Keith's a two-bit hustler. He runs a gambling operation out of his shack. Ask me, he wins way too often to be playing fair. I suspect he's running drugs, too. I just can't prove it. Maybe you can find something. Talk to him, poke around his shack, something. All right. Who are you again? Captain <laughs> Parker. I'm in charge of this camp. Alright. So we got another quest. Coyotes. Or coyotes. However you want to say it. And then I got... Is it in data? Should be, right? Captain Parker wants you to find evidence that Keith is running crooked gambling or involved with drug running. So where's Keith? Are you Keith? Nelson will serve as example. Welcome, sister. So deal with all these refugees. Poor lost souls, most of them. They thought to come to New Vegas and find their fortunes on its shining strip. But the journey is often long, and the price to enter the city is steep. Those who could not pay ended up here, hoping to earn the caps they need. Some find honest labor, but more fritter away what little they've saved on crooked gambling and cheap liquor. Still... I minister to them as I can. Okay, what do you do here, my boy? I give what aid and comfort I can. I have medical knowledge thanks to my time with the followers. Can you heal me? I would be happy to, should you require it. Alright. Oh, I got a healer here. Alright, where the hell is Keith? What the fuck was that? Boom! Is that a door I could go into? No, that's a window. That's a door I could go into. This is probably where Keith is, isn't it? Junkie, junkie. Ah, Keith! Hey there. Fancy a game of caravan? Boy, sure could use some drugs. You know, anybody else that sells drugs? From when I hear your plays are pretty unlucky, what's your secret? Come on back. Huh. 
I should come back when I give her speech. Unless I have a speech. No, that's not enough even with a speech book. Wait, I get to take this? I can take anything I want here? Let's go. What we got? What we got? Buff out. Damn it. I hear a troublesome legion camp got raised to the- Ah, by way! Our victory at Nelson's a worthy story. I hear a troublesome legion camp got raised You guys, to shut up! Oh, wow, there's more to this building than I thought. Maybe one of these is- But ignore that, maybe one of these is Keith's room? Filing cabinets. It's nothing but trash. And a little bit of drugs. Keith, where's your room? God damn it. Hey, Yosuke, okay, shut up. Damn it. Yeah, well. What? I can't steal from here? Is this Keith's dust? Oh. Marked cards. Well, there we go. Port back to Captain Parker. See, now if I actually cared about that caravan minigame, which I've never understood even to this day, I will take all his cards too. I'm just glad that uh, the casinos in New Vegas all have what's it, blackjack. That's like the only card game I'm good at. I say good at, but it's the only card game I actually know. Something I can help you with, stranger. Yes, here, take these cards, sweater. I got evidence. Keep has a set of marked cards. Marked cards, huh? I suppose it's obvious, really. Here, you've earned this. What I get? What I got? I'm gonna go take Keith into custody. If you're interested in a little extra pay, I wouldn't mind backup. You only gave me a hundred. You're not sure. Glad to have you. Let's go. Just stick close and follow my lead. Keith's a cowardly son of a bitch, but he might try something if he's desperate. I don't know if he wants to go against Spikin. Are you just gonna walk as slow as possible to Keith? You are, aren't you? Oh my god. Nice tree, buddy. Even Boone walks faster than you. I'm surprised I made that jump. He's always just gonna warp in here. Not gonna warp in here. Damn it, Keith. Hey there, fam. No. Oh Lord. Oh, one hour. There you go. Why are you still walking slowly? Just put your gun away. See you. What? 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 What just happened? Keith, explain. Hey there. Fancy. No. Where did you go? What? Have you found out what happened to the? What? What happened? What? What? I... What? Did... Boone, what just happened? I can't even reload that now, can I? No, I can't. What the fuck just happened? He didn't take him into custody. Fine, we'll take you into custody, I will. Uh-huh. <laughs> I sliced this dude! He landed on top of all three of them and he just go, uh-huh. Hmm. That's all they have to say. Well, I don't know what just happened, but whatever, I guess. Damn it, I didn't want you to kill him. Just find me some evidence. Keith. I just... What the hell? What just happened? Yeah, I'm done, I'm done. I'm not bothering with Keith anymore. Okay, is there anything else around here? The door there. That's about it. You suck at your job, buddy. Ooh, Salesman Weekly. 
there anybody in here? I don't... I don't think there's anyone in here or anything important in here. I'm not gonna look through all these dust, because there's probably nothing important. Dude, stop blocking my freaking path through the doorways, please. Bathroom. Oh. Are they gonna smack me in the face? What do you... A revolver? I mean, I could sell it, sure. Something to something. I'm not drinking from the toilet. What we got here? We got hula hoop. We got whiskey. Empty dusk. Oh, what's this? Drugs. Lovely. Ooh, good drugs. All drugs are good drugs if you try hard enough. Remember that. Oh, wow, there's just a bunch of magazines and drugs here. I'm fine with that. Anything else? Open dusk. Bottle cap. Guess that's everything? What's that? It's a pencil, goddammit. In here? I can't tell which room is which because they all look the goddamn same. What about here? Got a kitchen. Keychon. Yum yum doubled eggs. Oh! Bottle cap. Okay, so I don't remember how many star bottle caps we need. Parmi wants to say 25, so I say let's go to the to the factory to see if that's enough. Now that we got 25. Oh, or should we do that quest? Does it mark where we have to go? Where's west side? Move it. West side is over there. Which is kind of close to the factory, actually. This is in the factory. Yeah, alright, let's go to the factory, then we'll go to west side. Wait, I think I remember something being here. Wait, what the hell? There's a whole- I forgot there's a whole other side of this building. What are you, what are you pointing at, buddy? What was that? Why did you do, like, a Shao Kahn point? What was that? I'm a little scared. I'm mad I could have gotten more money or experience from from Keith, but he decided to be an asshole. What the hell is here? Oh, hi. Who are you? Come back here! You son of a bitch. Can't run from me. Where the hell did you go? There we go. This katana is really strong. No, God, my controller is so sensitive. How much? Is the battle helmet? Nah, it's not that much. It gives you perception. Now I know why I remember this place, because it's just raiders all over the place. Apparently more. I could go in here. Where the hell? Boon, why do you get to have all the fun by yourself? I say that, he's probably gonna die. He's gonna die. Nope, nope. Shoot me first, come on. Yeah? I will die for Boon. I see you. Okay, yeah, no, this katana is really good. Like, I knew it had really good DPS, but oh my god. What are you doing health-wise, Boone? You're perfectly fine. Ammo. I'm gonna go in that building that we could apparently go inside of. Where is it? What is that? There's like a whole bunch of sh I forgot how much you could explore in New Vegas. Holy hell. New Vegas Steel. Oh, uh, yep, figured. There's nothing I like better than making. No, 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 get away. Son of a. Come. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, his katana is so good! Are they all up? Yeah, they're all upstairs. How did he miss that? Leave my boy Boone alone. How about- I don't understand how you were avoiding my attacks. Come here. I'm stuck! What is happening? They're like merging inside of me! There. What's the other one? Oh! Level up. Let's go. Alright. I did say we need to start getting barter up. Let's get that up. Because now I can start selling crap for more money. Like all this flame fuel. Paint gun, scrap electronics. What's in the metal box? Nothing. I'm getting stuck on everything right now. I think one of the robot's bodies is like freaking out because I'm hearing a lot of noises. Boone, take that. Take it. Here, Boone. It's fine by me. There. Does he need ammo? I actually don't know. He's, he just randomly said I ran out of ammo one time and he started mailing people. Is there a point to this besides I think that book I picked up? Missiles are worth a lot, so I'm definitely picking them up. Flamer fuel seems to be worth a tiny bit. Boone, don't do this. Don't do this to me, Boone. I want to try something. Just, just, uh, just for curiosity's sake. Can I save? There we go. What? What? <laughs> Why is it I... Like the first second of me stepping on it hurts me. There we go. I just felt like cooking myself, okay? Don't judge me. Stop making all this noise! Oh god, it's so freaking loud on my end. Is there anything else? I don't think so. Yeah, I think we're good. I picked up a book. And I think it's one of those permanent book upgrades. Where is it? I'm gonna have to scroll through the whole thing if they didn't read it. Was it no, what's it fixing things? What's it? Energy weapon. Survival. I don't think it was a permanent book. Why did I pick this up? Science. Yeah, no. Medicine. No. Damn it. I want another permanent book. Oh, I didn't even notice you. I saw more books in there. A piece of range. Fixing things. Programmers digest. Tales of chivalry. Oh, it's a computer. Lucky 38 executive override? What? Was that to stop them from attacking me? It's a, it's a bit too late. Anything else? No, just food. Is that a bottle cap? Let's go. Alright, now... Let's go in here. I see that. That's definitely just a whole fiend thing in here. What is this called? South Vegas Ruins. Yeah. Stim pack, stim pack. I just used the steady like an idiot. Stop using studies! I'm so glad my katana has reduced spread now. And I was expecting to just get attacked this when I come in. Oh. I wasn't expecting this. Oh god, there's a lot of guys. What? Where did you come from? Come here. Your 
Yeah. So is that about blood? Hey, best damn it. Come on. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Okay, let me put this back on the hotkey now that I actually have some perks. Damn it, I was gonna finish on Boone. Or her, sorry. I discovered Vault 3. Okay. God, the sensitivity on my joystick. Is this worth something? Oh, it is, wow, okay. Cowboy Repeater. Someone else had that, or, or it's RCW? I think he's in the tunnel somewhere. Baseball bat. A lot of baseball bats. There it is. Repair it out and we're gonna sell it for some money. Alright, anything else around here? Yeah, that's a guy. Or a girl. Sight of your own blood. What was that about sight of blood? Okay, this katana is extremely strong. I really, really like it. Anyone else? I'm hungry. Where are you? He's behind there. Ooh. Where's the packs? Let's go. Oh, I'm take the dirty water. Where are you, you coward? Have at thee. Where are you? What? Oh, does he also have an RCW? Yosuke, calm down. How did I miss that? Is it over? What is this? Another exit? Or entrance, technically? Oh, right away. I guess it's another exit. To fiend territory? What? Oh, 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 oh! Okay. They were joking, they were joking! They hurt! Who are you? Oh shit. Well, I just got cooked cooked. I should've- should've been smarter instead of walking through a door that says feed territory. Oh god. Oh, hit me. You got me coward. Alright, where's Cook Cook? Oh, Cook Cook, where are you? Yeah, yeah? What are you gonna Cook Cook now and you don't got a fucking flamethrower? Yeah? Oh! You picked it up! <laughs> Thank you. Cook Cook's mangled head. Sure, I'll take that up. He has a flamer and an incinerator. Oh good, he has this metal armor. It's like a repair to one I have. Nice. Boone, what are you doing to me? Flamer. That's so heavy. I gotta get rid of nine pounds. Uh ba -ba 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 -ba. I don't wanna get rid of purified water. What do I have that's nine pounds that I can just get rid of? I don't want to get rid of Chopper. Also, I don't know why I still have it. I could just get rid of it. And this. Uh. I want to get rid of Shovel. Damn it! Do I have Nuka Colas? Besides the victory one? No, I don't. Darn it! 
I gotta get rid of four pounds. Uh, show. Anti venom weighs nothing. Okay. Fine. I'll get rid of some dirty water. There. Crazy. Yeah. Should I try it harder? Bottle cap. Isn't a hunting rifle worth a decent amount? Yes, it is. It's worth seven, seven, seven. Boom! Come here. Fine by me. All right. Carry the flamer. Carry the hunting rifle. Can you do that for me? Yes, you can. Brahmin meat, potato, cook, cook, fiend stew. I forgot you could find recipes while you're exploring. I doubt I can even cook it though. Bottle cap. Full cue. What was that? That's just me knocking something over. Cowboy repeater. Cook, cook. Alright, I want you to Fine carry this for me. me too, Boone. Carry both so we can just sell them because I'm not going to use that shit. Um. I say let's go to the vault. Stop doing that, Boone. I can make party time mentats. What does that do? Charis- Ooh. That's actually really good. Is it not just better mentats? Damage plus 20. Okay, that's actually really good. I'll make these. Can I? I'll make the maximum, cause I don't need whiskey. I don't care about the pods either. That, that resistance plus damage one is really good. It's just a cost stim packs. I don't want to, you know, just throw away all my stim packs for it. Alright, where's the ball? I think it's this way. No, oh, vaulty, vaulty. Oh, I see another victim. Yeah? You block with your fist? I'm actually kinda impressed by that. Alright, I don't know the other side behind the wall. Yeah? Yeah? You guys suck. Another varmint rifle. What's this little varmint rifles? They're not even worth much, that's the worst part. Just give me this so I can make more money. Kinda wanna get that praying mantis mantis claw, mantis something that the dude's selling at the shop yesterday where we bought the katana. Cause that seems like a really good unarmed weapon. And I can use unarmed, even though I'm at like what? 20? Where is it? Yeah, about 24 for the norms, but hey, I can still technically use it. Ooh, doctor's bag. What was that? I am so sorry, Boone. You have no idea how sorry I am right now. Boone, did you see the gun that was on the thing? It kind of flew into heaven when the bombs exploded. Was that a gun? That was a gun, like right here, right? Oh, it's gone now. Don't know what it was and kinda don't care. Dude, how are you doing? Yeah, I'll give you a snap back. God fucking damn it. There. Anything else around here that I could loot? I don't think so. Ooh, fresh pear. I, don't even, I haven't eaten a pear in years. I forget how they even taste like. 
All I remember is I don't really remember liking them. I prefer apples. Stop with the goddamn farmer rifles. I'm gonna assume going down at least the vault three. What do we got here? Alright, how many snapbacks do I have? I feel like I'm popping them all right now. When this one runs out, I'll, I'll use a super stim pack. What the fuck are you doing here? You got some kind of fucking death wish, asshole? Uh, your boss home, he summoned me here. I feel tough you are. Isn't it Vault 3, Home of the Fiends? Final warning, asshole. Your boss home, he summoned me here. Who the fuck you trying to kill? <laughs> You're lucky if I let you walk away from this asshole. I need to get a work, but uh, let's see how tough you are. All right, asshole. You just fucked yourself. Have at thee. You thought you like the fight. I gotta pop a super step pack right now. Oh, look at those heels. Where are you? Oh, you guys gotta gang up on doing like that. What do you ever do to y'all? I do, I do like the fight of my own blood. How did you guys know? You guys really can't handle a woman missing an arm using katana? You guys suck. That was easier. I say that as I'm bleeding out. Ooh, I'll take that. That's not worth much if I won't take it. Do any of you have fucking... <laughs> None of them have uh, uh, stim packs. That's wonderful. Wait, didn't... What did one... Did I sell the Ripper and I just picked up another Ripper? Is that what just happened? Metal armor, metal helmet. I have to put on the metal armor now. Well, I guess I'll drop the Ripper. Anything else? It's a machine gun. The one I already looked at. Notice the, yeah, the pile of corpses here. To repair that. No one had stim packs on them. 10 millimeters of machine gun, a hatchet, which I could use to repair, uh, damn it, I forgot the name. Grenades, let's go. Alright, let's do some repairing. Get this up. Get that. Knock, knock. Well, I can't repair knock, knock with a regular. Did I even pick it up? Oh, because knock, knock isn't a hatchet. Damn it. Alright, well, I'll drop it. Wait, did I not pick up another 10 millimeter? God damn it. I hope one, I don't know why they would, but it'll be a miracle if one of them has a super sludge. Boon, come here. Fine by me. Carry this. And this. Alright. Oh, we're just gonna raid a vault full of raiders. And annihilate them. This is my new katana. I have a grand old time with this thing. I hope I level up from this. Fixing things. Which I. Is that a magazine or is that a book? F. Fixing things. No, it's one of the little books. Pre war book, pre war book. Paperweight. Wrench. Empty, empty, empty. Ooh. Good. Let's go here. You like the sight of your own. Do you? Damn it, that. 
That's gonna stink. How are you blocking when you're laying on the ground? Screw you. Got a combat knife. That's what my boy Sulik used to use. How are you using a sinus machine gun? Brett. Who the hell is Brett? Damn it! I'll just take the snip pack so I don't, I don't want anything else honestly from there. Wait, did I go through? Yeah, I can't open that door. Okay. When I find you, I'm gonna eat your spleen. All right, yo, you found me. Ready for dinner? No. I guess he wasn't hungry. Ooh, another revolver. Can't run from me. Oh my God, thank you, Boone. Fine by me. Oh my God, Boone just saved my life. Can you carry this too for me, Boone? Not my strongs. Yeah, you and me both. Fine by me. You and me both. I get good. I can still carry stuff. Damn it, I want to fix Knock Knock. I'm sad that I can't find the stuff to fix Knock Knock. You ready to die? You got fucking destroyed, homie. Like the sight of your own blood. Where are you? Where the hell are you? Come here. There you go. I'm glad we're fighting all these weapons, because I'm just going to sell them all. I guess let's go upstairs. Got jets. Got a radio. Got a book. Pool cues. I wonder if there's like a special pool cue somewhere here. Everyone's using pool cues here. Ooh, ooh, let's go. I got so lucky with that. I'm lucky I looked at the goddamn pool tables. Chessboard. I could give a shit. I'm not a dragon's bitch like you. Quit your whining. Duffel bag, medical clipboard, bone saw. That medics? Oh, that's so rich. I stuck. No. Oh, give me up, give me up. Nothing up on this side, sadly. Alright, so we got that door. I could have sworn there's a whole other path. Yeah, there's, there's a downstairs. What's over here? And an upstairs. This place is huge. Ooh, looky here. Just a bunch of teddy bears though. Oh. Wow, I'm getting a whole bunch of stim packs. And here I was worried I was gonna use them all. Wonder glue, Nuki Cola. Nope, nope. Oh, I've just, I've been here. I just haven't been in here, so what's in here? It's a bunch of Nuka Colas. I am so happy I came here. All these snip packs, this one under the table. Thank God, milk. What is that? Tire iron. Uh, let's go, medics. Medics is gonna be very, very useful. Especially in the DLCs, because I feel like they're gonna, the DLC enemies are gonna kick my ass. Dirty water. Guess everything, right? Yeah. What's in here? 
Did that really just happen? All right, I'm gonna give the fourth lock a try. Did it really just do that? I don't know. Fourth lock breaks the door. There's another door though. I can't believe I just broke the fucking lock. I don't know how. I don't know. It requires a key to open. Uh huh. I am really disappointed with myself right now. I see why I don't have memories of using a force lock. Alright, what's down there? Oh, this must connect to the other side. Okay. Well, all I saw in that room was stim packs. I didn't see anything good, as far as I know. I gotta drink something. It's the dirty water. This is a. You like the sight of your own blood? I wasn't expecting a whole other area, but okay. Hatchet. Radix. Libby. Gibby. I would rather lockpick this shit. I think it's better to lockpick it and then use the computer because you get more experience that way. But I'm not desperate for experience right now. The hell is this room? Oh! Dino toy! I'm taking it. Bad data, can I read? Lovely! This is a regular book. Alright. Many people did a whole bunch of magazines. But I don't think they stack though, or do they? Because I remember using like three books and it, I don't think it stacks. I wish it did. I don't. God, this place is huge. Holy hell. I saw that. It's one of the good books, right? Yeah. Murderer, you're a fiend! Josuke, can you stop talking about eating my spleen, please? Ooh, turbo. I forget what Turbo does. Boom, back up. There we go. Oh, this was worth more than the one the other guy had. Fine by me. I'm so glad I got Boon with me to just carry everything from here. Carry the laser rifle. I don't know why that weighs so much more. Yeah? Yeah, let's go, look at the image. Let's fucking go. Bottle cap. Another flamer. Power fist! Not that strong, actually. Maybe if I actually... Did I hit that guy by accident through the door? Fine by me. I think I did. <laughs> Wow. Excuse me, thank god I'm finding all these guns that just sell now. Fine by me. Can you still move, Boone? Yes, you can. I need a key. There has to be a key somewhere. Or I could just go in here. What do you got going on in here? I gotta go back to the other floor because it's like a main door I completely went by. What the hell is that? Cigarettes. Okay, we're back here. Got a car toy. Hey there. Ooh. Did the prisoners just say hater to me? I think they did. The overseer's office. Magnum rounds. 
See, part of me wants to take bullets and sell them for caps, but I feel like there's no point unless it's like missiles. Missiles are super, pretty expensive when I sell them. What do we got here? Scrap metal, no good books. Overseer's office. Yep. Alright, what we got in here? The hell? Binoculars. Ooh. Oh, how I miss using the freaking hunting rifle. Such a good fucking weapon. It's goddamn 75 show. Tato Chris. Alright, we're gonna do a test right now. Let me save. What happens if I use two of the science books? Will it let me use this? No, it won't. I'm at 60. I need one more book. That's the thing. Okay, so it, so it does stack? Uh, where's my... Was it party stim pack or some shit? Am I still too stupid? Got me 69. What if I eat more? Nope. What am I at now? Still 69. Well... Wait, did they stack? No, it did it! Because it got me to 65. Okay, so I can only use a single book. I can't stack them. Damn, that sucks. Oh, I can't use the Overseer's terminal. Get back down. Now, I want to help you guys, especially, especially because I accidentally killed one of your buddies. If I think I killed him, I feel like I did. Alright, so we got downstairs, so I guess downstairs it is. Can I save while I'm, it's an evil guy in front of me? Right, where are you? You like the sight of your own blood? You guys love saying that, don't you? Damn it, that's going to stink. Yeah? I love this katana. Another hatchet. The hell happened here? Oh, he... He overdosed. <laughs> Speech plus two. Nah. There was something that gave me intelligence somewhere around here. That'd be great. Nothing else. So they just overdose and it leaves the bodies here? Okay. No, I don't want to sleep. Cigarette. Can I? Yeah. No. Medics. I don't care about that. I thought it was a book. Dresser. Sexy sleepwear. What a coincidence. Oh! Never mind, nothing on the computer. Mentats. Can I stack the good mentats with regular mentats? Psycho. Out. Lock pick plus repair. Huh. It's only worth one, so I might as well. It's an empty computer. What? That's different. Dirty. Oh, it's for an outfit. Never mind. Fission battery scrap metal. Okay. So you got up and... Is that water? What the hell was that noise? I heard a weird noise. I don't like that.
more bathrooms with nothing in them. Just okay, stop asking me about that. Oh, his name was Daniel. Damn, Daniel. Alright, let's go. I'm not gonna repair a grenade rifle even more. What's my explosives even at? 12. <laughs> Damn it. Bottle cap. Oh, here we go. Now we can send them free. Vault 3 maintenance key. Huh. Maybe now I could go to that door I accidentally locked on myself. I thought I could use this. Oh. Compose automated blast message. Okay. That didn't do anything. Locksmith reader. I don't know which books are the permanent books and which ones are not the permanent books. Other than the big book of science and... Uh, what's it called? Uh, pfft. something barbarian. I forgot his name. But I know that barbarian book is a permanent one. Nope. RR. Martin. The ridges. That's about trash. Yeah, boom. Another dino toy. What's this one? Utility. Oh. Well, I don't have to re repair it, honestly. More psycho. Ooh. No, I don't sit on the chair. Oh, oh. What have we got in here? Hello, Michael. I'm not Michael. Okay, that's up. We got this one. Water situation. Greetings, everyone. As you all saw in the message from Vincent, we're going to have to start rationing water until we can resolve the leaking issues. Fortunately, we don't currently have the parts requ required to fix the underlying cause of the leak. At this point, we have no alternative. But to seek the parts that we need from outside the vault. So let's take this. I'm proud to announce that Michelle Dalian will be forming a new committee. To go of creating ties with whatever civilization there may be in the outside world. Michelle and I both have high hopes that we'll have no problem finding the assets we need and hopefully forming some lasting relationships with the outside world. Thank you, Overseer Davis. Thank you again for agreeing to take charge with our external relations. I'm sure that you will do you will do represent us. Okay. And our interests well. Let me know if I could be of any assistance. Link. Thank you for your endorsement at the town hall meeting last night. You are so well respected by the residents, I am sure it will greatly increase my chances of following you to the big chair. Since the shell started making plans and gathering people for external associations committee, the isolationists have been gathering followers. As you well know, I think having me follow you as overseer will serve to slow their efforts. Thanks again, George. Okay. This is a fancy looking book cover. Anything else around here? So that's why there's water. I was wondering what the hell that water was. Why is there sexy sleepwear in every fucking room? It says a lot about society. That's one of the dino toys going off. Wait, are there multiple there? Oh, wow. Holy shit. This goddamn place is huge. No input. I don't know why I'm keeping looking through all this crap, but you never know what I'll find. Alright, so we got more water, more downstairs paths. That's a utility jumpsuit. I hear somebody talking, I heard that. Oh, that was Boone. I gotta go back and save our people stuck in the thing. I just don't feel like you're right now. Oh, that's what's making a noise. There's seriously nothing, any of this psycho. Can I get a book, please? I need more knowledge, please. Suck my dick. Okay, well, we went in a circle. Oh, perfect. 
the NCR took back Nelson. Maybe they can win this war after all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take down this password. It'll get you into the overseer's area upstairs, I think. Okay. Thanks for the help. We'll find our own way out. Fuck. It wasn't me that killed him, right? I hope it wasn't. Alright. Oh, I remember this! Well, as you select the fourth skill to be a tag skill, it should instantly raises it by 15. It should have 15 action points. Oh, wow. I like how they made it an actual action girl compared to the other uh, part one and part two. <laughs> Well, I mean, I really want to get Swift Learner or at least another intense training, but if I do tag right now, I could put it all towards barter and then I don't have to mess with barter for an, and basically anymore for a while. Yeah, let's do that. Hey, Nelson, maybe they can win this war after all. All right, well, you guys have fun sneaking out. I'm gonna go under the sea real quick. Actually, no, that's the overseer's office. Let's do that first. I'm gonna assume that key I found can let me go through the locked door. Have I not been in here or did I just closed the door? I think I just closed the door. Marduk 999. Oh, excuse me. Getting a sheath for the katana was a really good idea because it hasn't even dropped super low yet. I think I should start working on repair. Uh, probably soon, actually. Happy birthday. Hi, Jenna. How is school? You're going so far. I've heard of good things from your teachers. Ow. They say you're one of the top students in your class. Birthday's tomorrow, sweet 16 at last. Can you even believe it? Since like yesterday, my sister told me she was going to have a little girl. Do you have big plans for your birthday? I think you were interested. I could talk to some folks and get the dining room reserved for a couple hours. Let me know if that sounds like fun and I'll start getting the ball moving. So you've been friends for a while, so I hope you didn't take my candidacy for overseer personally. I'm going to do whatever I can to keep our friends and family safe. And if that means taking your exposure to the outside world slow and keeping to ourselves, outside of what we need, of course, then that is what I'm going to push for. No one knows what it's going to be like out there. There could be horrific mutants or strange wandering vagabonds. Aliens, murderous gangs. We have no idea. Let's be smart about this, Mike. Thank you. Greetings, everyone. Thank you for putting your trust in me. I am honored to serve as the overseer for the next term. And hopefully beyond, I am going to do everything I can to get Michelle's committee as settled as soon as possible. We'll get our water issues resolved and form lasting bonds with our neighbors and the world outside. Thank you for putting your trust in me. George. I'm not sure what Michael is planning, but I suggest that you leave the weapons in those two submerged storerooms. I'm pretty sure he doesn't have any support and there is no need to give him the opportunity to arm himself. Michelle. Unlock storage room doors. Well, let's see what's in the storage room. Hopefully I find more grenade launchers to repair the grenade launcher. So, which way? It should be right behind me. I, th I don't know why I thought that was one of the med boxes. Right, so we got, we need an overdose rooms. All right, well, time for a swim. I swear I heard some noise coming from the water and I'm scared, but... Oh my god, my oxygen. I thought it would work like Metal Gear. Okay, well we got a revolver down there we can sell and then a lockpick book and there's also more boxes. I gotta do this quick, that's the thing. Oh my god! I don't even think I could do this because I'll blow my freaking H2O gauges. I know there's a way you can make it higher. I forget what stat it is though. It's a specific stat. It's not endurance. Or is it?
Oh, first of all, let's put on armor that isn't heavy. In fact, let's just take armor off. Maybe that'll help me swim faster. If anything, I'll leave whatever to have in this room, because it doesn't seem that great. It's just locksmith reader and a revolver. That's all it is. Like, it's a really good, like, amazingly repaired revolver, but if I'm just gonna die, I wish I could stick my head above the water here. Also, what? What is happening to my... my sheath? I just realized. Huh. Why do I have 50 sheaths? What the? What is going on? I really am an amazing samurai, apparently. Is that just a glitch? Does it go away if I- Oh no, it's just there forever. Okay. What? Why am I invisible? Uh. Uh. That's Fallout for you. Wait, is it not my katana? That is the katana, isn't it? My katana is invisible now. What have I- What curse have I brought upon myself just now? Okay, I don't think there's anything worth it. I want to get the revolver, but I'm just gonna drown to death. Let's see what's on the other side. Maybe there's something better here. Alright, let's find out if I die. Just wanna see what the hell's here. Some machine gun. Looks like all garbage to me. Cobble repeater, that's worth it. Right, we got magazines. I don't think it's worth it, actually. Let me see what the magazines are. Is this the right? Yeah, those are good. If the magazines are good, then it's worth it. If they're not good, then who cares? Lots of reader fixing things. What is this? No search review? Oh, useless. Toolbox. Was that was that a clipboard I was looking at there? I couldn't tell. Here I am, just drowning my character over and over and over again with her fifty sheaths that she for some weird reason has. Now I wanna see an edit of Biking with like fifty freaking katana sheaths. That is a clipboard. Okay, yeah, no, it's nothing worth it here. In either room, honestly. Like, I can get the guns and sell them, but... I don't think I'm gonna make the trip back, so there's no point. Yeah, screw that. My space suit is broken, goddammit. I can fix it with the... Yeah. Okay, well that's everything for this, uh, section of the vault. Alright, let's get out of here and let's see if we can open that door and then go down that place I was thinking of. And that should probably be everything here for the vault. Is this where I came from? Yeah. Alright, so where... this? Can I go in here now? I cannot. What was that? That sounded like a good shot. Maybe I could open, open it from the kitchen side. Can, can, can. Tin can, tin can. Let's see. Can I open it from the side? Broken. 
Well, whatever is in there is stuck in there forever now. I mean, I could level up my lockpick to open the other door, but I don't feel like doing that. Is this the correct way? Or is this where I just came from? Oh. Maintenance wing. Oh! Alright. Wasn't expecting that. Alright, we got two doors. One door. Damn it, what you mean, damn it? What did I do? That's going to stink. Gonna stink. He's dead, homie. Yeah? Drink some water. What is that? He has a chainsaw? Whoa, 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 he's doing a lot of damage. Chainsaw. Where is it? I really like this. I'm probably gonna keep it. It ignores armor! <laughs> Alright, let's put some revolve some weapons on you. Fine by me. How much more can you carry? I think fucking question. Uh I gotta keep something that's ten pounds. Carry knock knock for me for now. I guess the liberator. And I need to use a cutium, yeah. They had doggies. Anything good? Blood pipe. Fiend. Motor runner's helmet. Maybe weapons plus five. Exception plus one. Where is it? I mean. What is happening to my... I, I'm dumb, I don't know. I have like summon source, but it's not a summon source or summon sheath. Oh, let's see what's behind these locked doors. I'm scared I'm gonna step on the bottom. Bottle caps. Fixing things. To a cabinet. Plunger. Seriously. Ammo. Is that all that's here? Can I get the good books and not the stupid crappy ones? That's all that's in here. Now I can, I can channel my inner ash now. Baseball bat, ammo, bottle of shotgun, which is actually worth a decent amount. Don't I have one in my inventory right now? I kicked the table, sorry about that. Uh, yes I do. I have multiple. Oh, what's that? Move the locks this reader, god damn it. Out the good books! Stop giving me the crappy books! Everything's empty. That was loud. Oh my god. There was nothing good in either of these locked rooms. I mean, yeah, I guess the magazine is decent, but I mean, it doesn't stack. Ah, whatever. 
at the end of this place anyways. I think I saw something about mods for this at the at the gun runners. Cause didn't it say like chainsaw something? Like chainsaw chain. Reverse pulse click. What the fuck is that? I'm taking that. Okay, my character is invisible forever now, apparently. Can't wait for the game to just randomly crash for some weird reason because I'm invisible. I know, I, you know, I'm going to say it and I'm probably going to regret it. This game has not crashed once for me. Well, actually, no. It froze. But it hasn't crashed crashed, like hard crash. By now, it would have crashed like 20 times or more on the PS3. I guess the PC version is that much superior. Oh, that's all they had here. At least I got the chainsaw. Wait, what's this? Empty syringe. So we're forming that the small water leak that we detected a couple weeks ago appears to be more serious than we first thought. We're going to have to vent the pipes in that section to isolate the leak and stop the pressure from stressing the rest of the system. Fortunately, this means that we're going to have to start rationing our water by pot. Wait, isn't it the same exact messages? Talk to him. Glad to hear that things are going well for you. I'm curious if you'd like to meet for dinner one day next week. I know we don't talk that often, but I feel like if we really clicked last night, I hope you feel the same way. Looking forward to hearing from you soon. Tiffany, last night was so much fun. I can't believe it took us this long to sit down and talk. Let's do that again very soon. Next time, maybe we can have breakfast together as well. Hey, buddy. Thanks for the advice. Dinner went great last night. I'm not sure I would have been able to work up the guts to talk to her if you had to convince me. Oh, you big time. I know you're be pretty stressed with the water issue, so if you need a break from some rec time, let me know. Okay. All right, hi Boon. There's still one little place we have to look. It's that door. Oh, it's just a tiny room. I was expecting like a whole other area. Anything important for me? Surprised the death doesn't have anything. Is there really nothing here? It's a jet. Oh, the psycho. Oh, never mind. Let's fucking go. We got a doctor's bag. Ooh, a stealth boy. Fresh apple. All right. Okay, well we're done with this area. Let's go. I think we should go to Gun Runners. See what we could buy armor wise and weapon wise. Now we have more barter and we have a whole bunch of crap to sell. The question is how the hell do I get out of here? <laughs> this is not the way. Well, Biking now has a katana and a chainsaw. Wait, is that not the way? I think it is. Living quarters? No, no, it shouldn't. That's not the way because the way out wasn't a enter the area thing. It was, I think it's over here where all these corpses are. Yeah, here we go. Alright, that was fun. Alright, let us buy armor. Oh, hi. Who the hell? I hear you took care of Motor Runner. I could have handled that on my own. Could you? I hear you took care of Motor Runner. I could have handled that on my own. Whatever you say, buddy. Whatever you say. Alright. Gun Runners, Gun Runners. What the hell was that? Fine by me. Regardless. Give me all this. First things first. I could have sworn it had something. It was either a chainsaw or a ripper. It had some sort of attachment somewhere. Chainsaw carbide teeth. Increases damage. Increases condition. Oh. 
Carling laser, hunting rifle scope. Hunting shotgun long tube. Primer, 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 ripper, HD, sniper, rifle, carbon parts. I gotta repair everything. No, no, no. I repair what I can repair first. Actually, maybe I shouldn't. I think it's better if I just sold. Yeah, I think it is better if I just did. Welcome, sir. Or Welcome, sir or madam. Right, let's get the chainsaw parts. I think I'm gonna be using that a little bit more. Uh, it's nothing I want weapon right wise. Oh, he has a chainsaw version, a gunrunner's arsenal version of the chainsaw. 89 damage, 85 DPS. 71 damage, 67 DPS. Okay, well. Where is it? Give me that. Kinda wanna get the sword, but. God, that's expensive. Oh, but the DPS is freaking crazy. Power Fist, the Ripper. Alright, armor. What can we get? I kind of want that. I think we could get that. I doubt we could get that, but... That's a cool-ass helmet. I, got, I, I want that just because it's cool. <laughs> Alright. See how much money we can make. Don't need that. Hunting rifle. Incinerator. Laser, laser rifle, auto shotgun, silenced. Damn it, I still need more. Okay. What should I not buy then? There. I'll well, get that part later. So over to Cumbered, apparently. For some weird reason. I, I want this cool ass helmet on right now. Combat armor marked reinforced mark two. Let's go. Let's sell the metal armor and a regular metal helmet, I guess. Welcome, sir or ma Fail. Don't regular metal helmet and metal armor I don't need anymore. Ooh. Can I move again? Yeah, there we go. With my weight. Good shit. Uh, mod. And we are definitely putting this on the hotkey on the left. Grenade, grenade rifle. Top right, like that. Katana will be down. Super Sledge will be right. Yep, and there we go. Don't, don't attack me. I can't with these, the fucking chiefs, dude. Like, I understand why the chief is like this. Why is there so many? It's like I have 50 swords, but I only have one. All right, well, we, that was great that we did that. Now I have way better defense. I could upgrade it more, I wish I could, but... You know, the helmet's just cool looking. Still saving this, because we should... Because it is still worth a lot, it's just... My barter is still with an upgrade. That's why is my character always sad? Oh, because he needs food, so... Alright. So what we should start working on now... Probably repair because oh let me use the um what's it called the repair kits better you know I would rather do that instead of spending a lot of money like making people fix things for me but yeah we'll do that next so now let's go back here 
And let us go to the Nuka Cola factory. There's also something here. I just love that I have a chainsaw now. What the hell? There's a bunch of dogs? Alright, these dogs hurt. <laughs> oh no, the poor dog. Still better armor, but they still hurt. Alright, we'll stick with the katana for a bit. But when something comes out with like heavy armor, we'll do the chainsaw. Or the super sludge when I repair it. I still want to just honestly keep putting points for his medicine just so Stipas could heal me so much more. Also, what did so much damage to me? Was it the dogs or was it her? I think it's the. I think it's the dogs. Yeah, it's the dogs I hurt. Yeah, yeah. Why are you running? Come here, doggy. Doggy, doggy. That was easy. The hunting rifle for me to sell. Violet mangled head, sure. Ooh, super snip packs. Top of the stim pack while I'm at it. Anything else around here? That's empty. This must be where her dog sleep. Or where does she sleep? Oh, she probably sleeps upstairs. Mm -hmm. What am I talking about? What's this? Okay, well, I guess that's everything for this area. Oh, there you go. You could call it quartz. Some water. Purified water. Detergent. Steam gauge assembly. Blah, blah, blah. See a book. Goddamn. Useless ass books. I mean, magazines, not books. Oh, it's this side. What's here? Doctor's bag. What is that? Steady. Impact rebound bucket. Whole bunch of water. Ammo. I forgot to sell the flamer fuel. Future weapons today. Camera. That's why. That's fucking empty. All right. So what do I need to work on right now? I need food and I need sleep. Let's eat something right now. Did that just say K fungus? Why do I have K fungus? I can eat this. Sure, I'll eat it. There, should be good on food now. It's like the gas. Something is markable here. I think it's the gas station. Yes, it is the gas station. Oh, there's something in the car. That's not duct tape. Give me the book. What? I hope, I hope everyone saw that. I'm reloading. I picked up the freaking duct tape by accident and the book just phases through the car. What the hell?
I can't even get it. Okay. We're getting this book. Like, I'm happy there's a weapon repair kit, but I want this book. Is this book even real? Are you fucking kidding me? Never mind, I give up on the book. Is there anything in here? I don't think it could go in, right? Yeah, no. Alright, well, let's go. We found a book that doesn't want to get picked up. A book that just becomes one with a car. And just never to be seen again. It's lovely. Oh, it's, all the, it's where we killed uh, Cook Cook. Fiend Brahma, I should kill you. Every night I will save your life. And every night I will be with you. And every night... I forgot the fucking lyrics. It just stays the same. Oh, well, we're here. Of course, there's nothing in the truck. Sunset Sarsaparilla Headquarters. I hope I have enough bottle caps. I have absolutely no idea if I do. That was a loud ass noise. A robot. An evil robot. Howdy, partner. I do not remember this. He's fucking creepy. Okay, Woody. Or if you have more important things to do than talk to old Festus, say goodbye. Uh, pleased to meet you. New in town, partner? Well, let old Festus give you the lay of the land. What's this eyeball missing? Redeem your sunset sarsaparilla stars, dump them into the slot in the barrel below, and I'll count them up. If you don't know what sunset sarsaparilla stars are, and think old Festus is just shooting his mouth off, I think that's not the only thing that got shot off, buddy. And you're here to challenge old Festus to a game of lucky horseshoes. Say, I feel lucky. Lastly, if you're here about the health advisor. Health advisor. Channel 6 recently. Say, silly old advisory. <laughs> silly old advisory. Star info. Okay. Select sunset sarsaparilla bottles will have special caps with blue stars on them. Uh -huh. These caps are known as sunset sarsaparilla stars. Why are these stars there? And what do they mean? <laughs> Nobody knows. Except maybe old Festus. <laughs> mm -hmm. Rustle up enough of them and you can win a prize. So get out there and start drinking sunset sarsaparilla. How many, though? You didn't tell me how many. Howdy, partner. Welcome to the headquarters. If you were old... Uh, silly old advisory. I'm sorry. Silly old advisory. I'm sorry. I didn't quite understand that. Could you repeat it? While Sunday there you go. Sarsaparilla is perfectly safe, a recent independent study whose validity is currently being challenged... <laughs> Oh. Nausea. Oh. Numbness. Anxiety. What is digital numbness? Loss of visual acuity. Dizziness. Occasional nosebleed. <laughs> Joint inflammation. Oh my Tell god. Sore throat. Bronchitis. <laughs> Organ rupture. And halitosis. Okay. 
okay. You'd have to drink a heap of sunset sarsaparilla to match the quantities used in the study. <laughs> How much, you ask? A lot. A whole hell of a lot. Oh. In fact, you'd have to get full as a tick on sunset sarsaparilla to even come close. Anyway, thanks for stopping by. So you mean when I chug like 50 bottles in a row? I feel lucky. If this is your first rodeo with the old horseshoes, say... How do I play? Lucky horseshoes is played with cards number 2 through 10, and you and old Festus will take turns drawing cards. Each time we draw a card... Okay, so it's like black. If either of us draws a card that brings our total up to the... When this happens, it's called Lucky Horseshoes. When one of us is closer to 21, you can't get any closer, and the other can't get any closer, either by going... Old Festus likes the game, because there are no ties in luck, but enough jolly. Uh, sure, let's go to try. Alright, let's play, partner. Uh, blue. Looks like you got a four, partner. Yeah, you're doing well. Old Festus looks like I... How the hell you got a f nine? Looks like you got a nine. Yeah, hey, you're doing well. But old fast looks Looks like you got a five, partner. Yeah, hey, you're doing Wait, well. Wait, what am I at? Fuck, I, don't, I forgot where I'm at. Looks like Damn it. Like Howdy, partner. Alright, deposit. It looks like you got a Commencing attack on hostile target. Your cooperation. Okay, well, it's not 25. Oh, good, I get to keep him. It's not. Is it 30? Watch it be 50. It looks like. It's probably 50. Alright, where the hell are you? Because you know, you're a robot, so she's just. I honestly wonder if it's like a super rare chance of Can't run from me. getting a star cap just from drinking a sarsaparilla. Are they on the second floor? I think they are. What do you mean? I'm not even using violence yet. But I'm ready. You couldn't tell. Cabinet, cabinet. Empty desk, empty desk. What the hell are you? This is a lawful use of deadly force. Please direct complaints to your local law. I don't like how they seem to be everywhere but nowhere at the same time. Oh! Okay. Why are there just destroyed robots everywhere? Those goddamn buildings. Oh my god! Oh! Oh, my heart! Boone, what's going on? Where the hell are they coming from? Listen, you got in my way, okay? Leave me alone. Oh boy. Let's go in here first, actually. I don't know what's in here. It seems like a dead end to me. Never mind. I'm not gonna step into anywhere, you son of a bitch. Inside, there's no bottle caps around here. Hi. Marker number 27438 reporting. There seems to be a malfunction with the light, sir. Wait a minute. You're not my manager. Intruder! Here we go again! I ain't do nothing! I ain't do nothing! He started us! Well, now I know where to get a, a whole crap ton of Sunset Sarsaparilla so if I'm that freaking thirsty. Then again, it doesn't make my thirst, like, better. Okay, I need to find this dude. He's being annoying. Scanning. 
Guess we're gonna do something but crease and crease a sarsaparilla. Where are you? Are you downstairs now? Where the hell are you? Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's here? It's a pee pee room. Oh! Ooh, super step back. Let's go. Broken custodial robot. Oh my god, he's. Stepping on these robots makes the loudest fucking noises for me. Out of order. Another pee pee room. It's a broken toilet. I appreciate all the super stip packs though. Honestly, if there's not a single star bottle cap in this entire building, I call bullshit. Oh my god. I already know I'm not going to be able to pick this lock. Oh, I can. Never mind. Okay, well, it's to the left. There you go. Ah! Damn it! Never mind. Never mind what, Boone? Ooh. Oh, it's probably just opens the safe, right? I mean, it might as well do it. It's very easy. It's close to done. It's a bone. Not bone. It's a dome. What? I don't even know what letter is the one that is correct, apparently. Freaking computers. God damn it. Dot removed. Dot removed, dot removed. Really, no allowance thing? They never want to give me the allowance thing, ever. Did I do this one? I didn't. Is there any other ones? What about this one? There we go, okay, good. Is it home? Okay, it was the E, it's not the O. But they have no new messages. Check saved inbox messages. What contest? So the rumors of some sort of contest are quickly growing out of control. We're getting flooded with calls and messages asking if it's true that we're redeeming bottle caps for prizes. Do you want me to make an official statement denouncing this rumor? Kind of, I hope you've been impressed thus far as your recent purchase. Your company has been and continues to be a valued customer. Contact me if you have any questions. Save set messages. What contest? Say, are you out of your mind? Or have you seen the latest sales figures? We're up 300% since these rumors started. Are you asking if I want to make it stop? Please stop by my office so we can further discuss this issue. Marcus, I have a few ideas about how we can turn this whole contest situation to our advantage. I'm going to need you to work with the advertising guys on a very special project. And meeting requests will be sent out soon. By the way, how do you feel about Cowboys? Oh, that's how Festus was created. To be happy with the performance of the new model. If its current performance is of any measure, it promises to reinvent my company's entire distribution network. I'd like to tentatively discuss purchasing a few more in the near future. How soon do you expect more to become available? Alright. That wasn't to unlock the freaking thing. Anything else on the second floor for me to check out? Stairs that go down. It's that room. All right, well, let's go down. What have we got around here? Of course, of course. Of course there's a very hard door that you need a hundred fucking lock for to flick. Let's go over here, what's here? There's still a robot roaming around somewhere. Requires key, lovely. I legit want to know what that robot is. But then it's still- yeah, there's the locked door. God damn it. I'm going in circles. Where's the uh, factory place? 
Here, here we go. Boom, did you try to drop that on my head? Mr. the janitor, okay. I thought the game crashed. Oh, come on. Snake-like. Boom. That one. I think that's all of them. The elaborate? Oh wow, okay. I just got lucky with that one. Check mail. Water leak. As long as you guys know we've had reports of possible small water leak in the upstairs meeting room. The long term effects of water damage can be very, very expensive, so accept this problem solved before it gets any worse, okay. I wanted to personally congratulate you on the success of the new automated janitorial system. In particular, number 135 has proven very popular with staff. I can't tell you how many complaints I used to hear about stray bottle caps getting into the machinery. Oh, we should have a meeting soon concerning the rest of your staff. Check maintenance system. Activate worker. Oh. Hey, buddy. I see my services are required once more. It's about time. Uh huh. No, oh, have fun cleaning, I guess. Where do you go? Is he still in the room? No, oh, he just left. Can these noises stop, please? Scrap metal. Toolbox. Damn it. I still gotta find that room where that robot is. Is it this way? I think it's that door. We got in here. Dirty water, squirrel bits. Since this has the riddle box. Oh, looky here. Oh, this is where they are. Multiple hostile targets. Wow, boom. There we go. There's a door. This room is even worse than the last. <laughs> Hi, buddy. What a pure coincidence that he ended up showing up here. Does it go outside? It does go outside. Okay, so there's no point to going outside. Hi, buddy. I expected more star bottle caps. I didn't expect there to just be one in this whole building. I think it's 30 bottle caps. That's a bottle cap. <laughs> I feel like that guy got crushed by a goddamn crate. So he's underneath the crate. There's nothing but empty bottles in here. Alright, well, let's see what the terminal says. Ah, oh, damn it. Superior. Dud. Dud. Standing? Oh, close to standing. Uh. Is it starting? Okay, it's close to starting and standing. Settling? Got there. You have a fun cleaning, buddy. Up here, nothing. That's already there's a whole crap ton of shit here. Oh! I didn't mean to do that. Wait, can I just? I can't. Maybe they're hiding something. Show me your secrets. Nothing there. So where did he go? 
A body disappeared. I don't know where he went. I would have. Oh god, I was so scared. I would have laughed if he put like a gun or something and hit it in one of the boxes. Oh, come on. Trading. Plus the grasping. Firmly grasp it. Is that the only two? Are you kidding me right now? God damn it. Grasping. Training. Okay, thank God. I apologize up front if there are any mistakes in this message. I'm trying out a new this dictation headset. Margie the boss made just order some kind of newfangled robot supposed to take over some of your deliveries. I'm supposed to talk about it, but you should hear about it soon. I'll write again when I know more. Do not pass this along. If you got trouble with that, how shall I experiment the robot I told you about the other day? The damn thing is single-handedly running all of our distribution in New Vegas area now. Your boys are on temporary leave. It's permanent. Damn, the president wants to see me in his office. I'll finish this later. Okay. Where our robot buddy go? He was talking mad shit. I don't know where he is. Oh, buddy. Oh. Well, we found where he put his trash. That's a really good amount of bottle caps. Okay, I think that's everything I could technically do right now. So I don't have amazing lockpick, and I don't have enough star bottle caps. It's the wrong way. Damn it. The hell is the exit? Or entrance, technically. Is this it? Yeah. Have I been here? I haven't even gone here. What the hell happened here? Someone got freaking annihilated. I'll never find a body with just battle, battle caps on him. Okay, never mind. There is more to this place than I thought. Okay, that just leads outside. What is over here? Nothing? Seriously, nothing here? Okay, I guess there's nothing. I was expecting, I don't know, anything? Why are there ashes? What the hell? I guess someone was doing jet in the back room and the robots come. All right, well, we're done with this area for now. Do I have enough bottle caps now? Howdy, partner. Shut up, Festus. It looks like you got- God damn it. What am I at? 28. It's probably 50. But I need 50 caps. Alright. Let us head towards where the quest wants us to go. And then we can finally enter Freeside and enter New Vegas. Is there anything in these trucks? You know, I'm not gonna bother. I just want to leave. Here we go. I'll check this one truck. This one single truck. I didn't mean to do that. It's just empty bottles, of course. Well. Head on out. I'm back. Okay. Really? What the hell is that? Who the hell puts a Sussex Sarsaparilla inside of a mailbox? Speaking of, it's just a lone bottle just sitting in this house right now. And it's empty. Oh, we're at the west side. And it's 
gunshots at the west side right now. That's great. What is going on? I don't remember this being a part of West Side Story. Are they shooting each other? They're both enemies? Scorpion gang member. And a fiend. Inaccessible, okay. Where'd you go? You're evil, you have to die apparently. Sorry. Sorry, Omi. What the hell? There's still a whole bunch of crap happening. Can I squeeze through here? Yes, I can. Where the hell is that coming from? Can I go on any of these? No, I cannot. The thorn. What the hell do they run into? You put bottle caps though. Someone finally just down that sick and run a son of a bitch. Good riddance. I, I took care of him. Oh, there's an entrance. So we got a door to the west side and we got the thorn? What's over here? Anything here? I feel like there's nothing here. Yeah, that's nothing. Well, um... I kind of want to see what's in the thorn. So let's go to the thorn. Carly clothes. Never mind. I saved you guys' life, but I'm not allowed on the thorn. Alright, well, let's go to west side, I guess. What's in here? I don't even remember west side or the thorn. Pop a heal. Acme reality. Water Brahmin. Oh, hello. Hi, Hector. What do you do here? I deliver things and stuff for the people here. They give me caps to do it. Okay. Bye. What the hell is this freaking Brahmin doing to me? Howdy. Got a bakery. That's the liquor store. Let's go inside there. This just screams new to read on me, and I don't know why. It's the store owner. Oh. Howdy. Name's Bob, but folks around here call me Klamath Bob. Huh. What can I do you for? Are you from Klamath? I take you from Klamath. <laughs> yeah, good old Klamath. Yep. Not a bad place if you like hunting, eating, and skinning geckos all day. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's a pretty dull place, but I hear there was a bit of excitement when this tribal from Arroyo came to town years back. All before my time, though. Yeah, it was Coco. What do you have for sale? All right, then. An aid, musk. What you got a musk? Got nothing. Question about the area. I might have some answers for. It. What do you do around here? I run the liquor store on West Side. With things this rough, some folks need a lot of booze just to step out of the door in the morning. After I close up shop, I walk around and help keep the peace. Not that I'm good with a gun, mind you, but someone's got to do it, you know. Mm-hmm. Tell me about West Side. Well, things aren't great here, but I've seen a lot worse. We've got the fiends to the south of us, and that ain't good. The scorpions hang out at the Monte Carlo when they aren't slinging chems or getting their heads blown off by the fiends. Probably the best thing we've got going on is the co-op, run by Mr. Etienne. Get some help from the followers of the apocalypse, I think. Okay. Do you have a lot of run-in with the fiends? Not so much lately. The NCR is giving them hell any time they poke their damn heads out. Bless those boys and gals for getting rid of that vermin. I feel pity for any man or woman that gets addicted to chems, but when they prey on decent folk... Well, then it's time to put them down. Yeah, you're not wrong. Not much to tell. Typical gang of dumb bullies and angry nobodies. They're holed up a bit south of here, in the Monte Carlo Suites. They think they're tough, but any time they tangle with the fiends, they get torn right up. That's great. What's so great about the co-op? Food from the people and for the people. Anyone can buy, but the profits are shared by the folks who make the produce. Locals got these little gardens that do real well. Gosh darn well, truth be told. 
Etienne got some help from that Anderson kid, I think. Anyway, we don't gotta rely on merchants so much. And it means the troopers can use all the food they make over on east side. <laughs> it works out nice. That's an east side. Well, of course it's an east side. It's a fucking west side. Enough about west side. What else? Don't you think about the super mutant walking around? That's a super mutant walking around town? Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's mean son of a bitch. That's I know his the name? name sounds bad, but he likes it. He's one nasty old coot. <laughs> as far as I can tell, he's one of them original super mutants. What came from the boneyard. Wandered about after that master fellow died. Eventually got caught somewhere around the hub back in NCR. Boy, they sure treated him mean down there. Cut him up so bad he can't talk no more. Damn. I tried to buy him just so they'd stop hurting him. But they didn't want any of it. Do you know how he got away from the NCR? Turns out some of them night kids, whatever you call those sneaky super mutant types, got in and busted him out. I guess somebody named Tabitha led the bunch that freed him. Don't know much more than that. Okay, how do you end up in Westside? He just showed up here one day. Couldn't really talk, but he remembered me all right. Ever since then, he's just been, well, hanging around, I guess. Does odd jobs for folks and smashes the bad guys when they come poking around. Nice. People around here aren't afraid of him? Some folks steer clear of him, for sure, but you don't seem to mind. Heartache by the number. What up? Troubles by the score. Every day you love me less. Each day I love you more. I got hardest by the number. Where? Where is the super mute? I didn't even see him. I do not remember this area at all. Okay, he's just a citizen. Just a citizen sleeping outside like most citizens do. I want to meet the super mutant. Where is he? I like that his name is Mean Son of a Bitch. I think that's a great name. <laughs> you guys are just sleeping on the ground? This area is confusing. What is this? Nothing, okay. I'm lost right now. Okay, this is the liquor store. Let's go over here where the kid was at. What is that noise? Is that the... Hey there. That's my sheath, isn't it? I think my sheath are like bumping into crap. Sort of knocking down, getting knocked down with some crap. Please don't make that a permanent noise I'm going to hear for the rest of the game. If I'm going to have to console command these, these sheaths to go away, I will. Oh, that's the co-op. Or you. St. James. When I talk to a girl, I start the conversation, and I didn't start no conversation with you. Okay, sexist piece of shit. Some people have gone missing, and they were last seen dealing with you. What do you do around here? Me and Dermot work salvage around New Vegas. Tell me about Dermot. What do you even mean? He's Dermot. Or Dermot. Dermot knows how to work salvage better than any man I ever met. Doesn't go asking questions all day, neither. Some people have gone missing, and they were last seen dealing with you. I don't know a thing about no missing refugees from that Aerotech camp. Go cry to somebody else. I didn't mention Aerotech. Yeah, well, I must have heard rumors. And, uh... Fuck you, you got nothing on me and Dermot. Whatever you say, buddy, whatever you say. So where's Dermot? First of all, I want to go in here. What's in here? Hi there. Welcome to the Westside Co-op. I'm Clayton Etienne. Let me know if you have any questions. I don't like the look of that poster behind him on the right. Show me what you have for sale. All right. Oh, all you have is food. Okay. What's your story? Well, I've lived in Nevada all my life. Started out in New Reno, but headed down here as soon as I got don't a chance. Don't talk about New Reno! I believe it, things are even worse back home. The whole city's still run by crime families. It used to be the Mordinos and Wrights. Now it's the Wrights and Van Graffs. Seems like things never got better. Anyway. That's all behind me now. Oh, uh, tell me about the co-op. Why is it called the co-op? It might not look like much, but it's what keeps us Westside locals independent. We started it a few years ago. I admit we had a lot of trouble at first, but eventually we got some help from Tom Anderson with the followers. We're finally to the point where the co-op members can start making money from sales instead of just breaking even. We just rode a stranger one fine day. 
Harley's folks and folks around him didn't have too much to say. Okay, well, now nowhere to buy food. No one dared to make a surprise. Uh, that looks disgusting. A big iron on his hip. A big iron on his hip. I kind of like being a farmer. Okay, that's good for you. Okay, well, it's the apartment, so that's where his crap is. Are you mean, son of a bitch? Oh, hi. Uh, who are you? Marshal Fabrice. <laughs> Do you have trouble speaking? I have a go bow. Goodbye. What's a superman like you doing in a place like this? <laughs> I wash my bone with Sibbe. I have Bogo. Phoebe's a rope. Goodbye. Oh, hi again. Okay. Mm. I like him. He's cool. Judah Prager. You don't strike me as someone down on their luck. What brings you to Westside? What do you do in Westside? I help tend the crops, stand watch for fiends, and generally help keep things civilized. Do you? How long have you lived here? A couple of years now. I was a trader for a while, but got tired of all the walking. Westside was a good place to settle down as any. All right. Oh, I thought I was going here and deal with these assholes. I do not remember ever doing this quest. I read come. I feel like I've been here once, but I don't remember anything about it. Welcome to the casa. As long as you didn't come here to sell that scrawny ass of yours around here. Okay. I'm not hiring new girls. All slots filled, you could say. And my arrangements with Marco are exclusive. You sure know how to make a girl feel welcome. Just needed to make the situation clear is all. How can I help you? Who's the merchandise? Three flavors to choose from. Sweetie, Maud, and Jimmy. Jimmy? Sweetie's the house favorite, for reasons that should be obvious. Maud is what you might call the discount rack. She's what a customer wears if he doesn't have the caps to afford Sweetie. Or just likes them old. Okay. Jimmy's more of a specialist. I only hear good things. All right. What do you do around here? I look after the only reasons anyone would want to spend any time here. I'm a pimp. All Marco does is collect rent and take a small cut of my action. He sure as hell doesn't clean the rooms. All right. You're not one of the merchandise? Most of my body is scarred all over. Like a ghoul. Nobody around who'd want to screw that. No, I just run things. How'd you get burned so badly? We don't talk about that. Next topic. Okay. You know where to find me. Marco's apartment. I gotta find a room. Oh, well, I, I just found a room. Hi, Derma. I don't like these noises that I'm hearing. I really don't like these noises that I'm hearing. Going to be a little different than the one I had kept for Holly Scrap Pop. I've always been a strong believer in keeping straight books. Two motor rudder. Teen girl. 500 caps. This world paid top money for the girl plus bonus for first delivery. But paid nothing for girl's father who took a swing at him when on tie. Gotta keep him more secured. Also, I stay off the girls as even fiends don't want used goods. Adult woman, old woman, old man, baby boy. Run it like the woman, of course, but the baby's worthless up to make sure the woman does as she told. Her parents next to worthless should have killed and left them. On the bright side, Runner says we can start dealing with fiends closer by, so no more dragging folks all the way to Vault 3. Teen girl, teen boy, child girl, seven. More like it. Learn from the path I got rid of mom and dad along the way. I tried to get more of the young one. I said, hey, give her time to sprout, but nephew wouldn't have it. Kept SJ off the girl so long as... He got his damn, damn teddy. It's a sick one, but I guess the work calls for it. Did not like dealing with this cook cook. Didn't know if he'd pay us or burn us. I guess what they do with them once they got them, it's up to them. It's not my business, but it doesn't even wait for us to turn the corner before he was torching the boy, making the woman folk watch. Let's hope to deal with Nephi next time. You son of a bitch. Alright, well, that's his shit. The NCR took back Nelson. Maybe they can win the. I got nothing you need. If it's ass you're looking for, talk to Pretty Sarah. <laughs> Me and my partner St. James work salvage around Westside. That's all. Uh huh. Why is your partner called St. James? Because it's his name. He may be high strung, but he's all right. Hauls his half a scrap, which is all I need. All right. Yeah, beat it. Beat it, beat it, beat it, beat it. 
I think I'm allowed to lockpick this room. What? It wasn't red! I'm telling you right now, the door wasn't red. You know that, Boone. You saw it. Well, I guess I'll go upstairs. All these rooms seem pointless and empty. They seem very pointless and empty. Boone, stop blocking my fucking voice. Here's Amanda's apartment. Was it Amanda or Anderson? It's Anderson's. Tom Anderson, can I help you? How do you sleep through this? What do you do here? I'm with the followers of the apocalypse, and I help the locals in Westside grow crops. Unlike the NCR, the followers don't expect anything back. The soil and the hot, dry environment don't make it easy, but we get by all right. We've even got our own food store. The West Side Co-op. Oh, you got a pit boy. With basic refrigeration. Tell me about the co-op. The co-op is comprised of West Side locals and read by Clayton Entenane. They produce all of their own food and share the profits of the co-op. Nice. Do you have a problem with the NCR? I don't go looking for fights with them, but they don't have the best interests of people in mind. Certainly not locals. The bottom line for NCR is productivity and growth. Politicians back in Shady Sands are completely detached from the people actually living here. Kind of a good thing, honestly. I don't like the NCR and Shady Sands. They're kind of assless. It's my boy! I love that Aurora is great. They're having a great time playing Mario Party upstairs. Don't worry, guys. That's all they're doing upstairs right now, okay? Someone just stole all the stars from somebody else. Don't worry. Why is it evil for me to open the store? Why am I, I... I don't know why I'm searching every single room, but nothing seems to be good in any of these cartoon rooms. My frames just died because I did that. Oh, you're a sweetie. Okay. Hi, sweetie. Hey, honey. Looking for something softer than a man can give you? What does it cost to hire you? It's worth every cat, baby. I'll do things to you you didn't even think was possible. And leave you feeling like everything's right in the world. 300 cats. Never mind. Keep telling yourself. You work for Pretty Sarah? I bring in the customers and she makes sure no one gets rough. Sarah's good people. Good enough, anyway. Tell me about yourself. I'm called Sweetie because I'm the sweetest piece you'll ever find anywhere outside of the strip. Mm hmm. Wouldn't you make more money working on the strip? That's true. I got my start at the Gomorrah. Good money, but I saw how those Omerdas hook girls on free jet or medex, then start charging. Slavery through a needle is what that is. I earn less out here, but I keep more. Hmm. Any chance you could help me get into St. James's room? Does St. James pay you for anything unusual? A client's got a right to privacy, so it'll cost 200 caps for me to tell you all about it. Let's say 100 caps so you could earn zero keeping your mouth shut. Funny how I make caps every time I open my mouth. Wow. St. James's problems, that's for sure. Never wants me to say a thing or for me to move around either. Lately, he brings a teddy bear with him and props it on the bed like it's watching us. Ugh, it's creepy as hell. <laughs> oh my god. Not the worst I ever been with, but more a pervert than most. Okay. Do you know St. James? Sure do. St. James is my number one customer. He's a prospector who pays Marco to stay here at the Casa week to week. I don't know why his friend Dermot chose to stay here. He's never been with me or nobody else. But St. James likes having me close at hand. Okay. You just give me St. James' room. I do have his spare key, but I'm not sure if he'd like it if I let you in there. Forget it. I mean, I already opened the door, so... You, you can't do anything for me. <laughs> Oh, where's well, Maud? Don't see many of your kind here in the casa. Women, I mean, who ain't working. Aren't you kind of old to be doing this? Old but spry, honey. So long as my back don't give out. Oh my I god. Can make a living lying on it. May not oh. be as fresh as Sweetie or Jimmy, but pretty Sarah keeps me around for a good reason. Experience. Okay. You work for pretty Sarah? That's right. Strange at first, having a woman for a pimp, but she's tough enough to handle any trouble so far. Tell me about Sweetie. 
She's a good earner. Of course, she don't care who she sleeps with or what they do to her. What do you know about Jimmy? I suppose he's okay for one of those. One of those what? Pretty Sarah's got to cover every sort of customer. What do you know about Dermot and St. James? Those boys been living here a while now. They sell salvage and do all right. I never been with either of them. That St. James is all over Sweetie every time he rustles up the caps to a forder. She says he's peculiar, but who isn't? Okay. Who is St. James? Why is, I, why is there a dialogue option for him every time? Where's Jimmy? I want to know who Jimmy is. I'm legit curious where, what Jimmy looks like. Is that Jimmy? Hi, Jimmy. Sorry, man, but my services are members only. All right? You might try Sweetie. Oh. I hear you were a slave of Caesar's Legion. I'm just a fantasy come to life. But you already knew that. Been working here long? Half a year or so. The Casa is a dump and Marco's a pig, but pretty Sarah makes sure I don't get hassled. I don't get as many customers as Sweetie or Maud, but the customers I do get always come back. Okay, about pretty Sarah? She's an honest woman. Splits the earnings fair and keeps Sweetie and Maud in line. Minds her own business, too. She knows what it's like for people to go through things they'd rather not talk about. That's good. How much for your services? Sorry, ma'am, but ain't enough caps in all of New Vegas to make me do that. Nuh-uh. Oh. <laughs> See you. Happy Pride Month, everybody. Alright. Where... Where is the room? Is something going... Is it downstairs? Is that another floor? I guess it's downstairs, but I just missed it. Which room? In here? Does it want me to take the... So Captain Parker, what happened to the missing refugees? Confront Dermot or St. James with the evidence you gathered. I want to know who St. James is. Where is he? He's in here? No, that's Dermot. Well, let's confront Dermot, see what he has to say. They're really loving the martyr party. Howdy. I said, fuck off. Fuck you. I know what you and your partner have been up to. I got evidence. You're right about that. St. James, got a thief here. Uh -huh. Aha. Is that a good idea, buddy? Where's your St. James buddy at, huh? Oh, seriously, where is he? Uh. Someone finally put down that sick motor runner, son of a bitch. Good riddance. You can just talk to the whores, you know. Okay. Where is St. James? Robco jumpsuit. I don't think St. James is a real person. I uh, used to do it. No, his name is a St. James. What's just his name? Oh, it is. We gotta go through this again. I found what I look what I found in your room. Show him the teddy bear. What are you doing stealing my stuff? That ain't even mine. I mean, it's mine, but it's private. Give it back. Oh, it's the teddy bear oh, from a little girl. Back. I don't care. Just found it when we was working salvage and thought I'd save it to give to some kid if one came by. We gotta go through this again? Hey, you spent most of your cast on Sweetie. I found this ledger in Dermot's room. You got his book? Dermot, this bitch got your book. She got your book. Oh my. Good riddance, honestly. Chris has jet. All right, well, let's go report it. And we'll come back and explore the rest of this area. There is more to explore. 
I'm still mad about the freaking dude. He said I'm gonna I'm gonna drag him to prison, and he just didn't do anything. So I had to freaking kill him. Have you found out what happened to those missing refugees? Saint James and Dermot were behind it. They're dead now. How do you know? Did you find proof? Found us evidence in their rooms. They attacked when they confronted them. Oh, sick bastards! Can't say I'll shed any tears for them. Here, you've earned this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go. You barely gave me anything. Fucking like cheapskate. There. Right, let's go back over there. See if there's anything else. The pawn shop that I haven't gone inside. Goddamn it, boy. Ooh, lever action shotgun. Interesting. Hunting rifle. I'm glad mean son of a bitch is on our side. If you're down on your luck and need some caps, I'd buy just about anything. Of course, I've also got plenty of things for sale, too. Uh, so what you got for sale? Brass knuckles. Mantis gauntlet. That's just a regular version of the gauntlet I saw at Mix. Metal armor reinforced. No. Anything katana related in here? Need some money to milk bottle, blah 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 blah. Red plate. You have nothing. You have good ammo though. How long have you been a West Side? My grandfather opened up this shop. Took over from him when the fiends killed him. Alright. You have to deal with the fiends and then that gang of freaking assholes. Get me some money too. Uh. What? I didn't know there was a sewer we could access. I kind of want to go check that out, actually. Hey there. Where are the fiends and then the gang they were talking about? This place is kind of confusing with all the rubble. Where the hell are the fiends? What's this? Just what a decent place to look at. There's nothing useful in it, like always. Yep, nothing useful at all. Let's go. Anyone important here for me to talk to? The NCR took nope. back Nelson. Maybe they can win this war. You're welcome. Are right there a group of people standing here? Okay, you guys are just chilling, apparently. Well, I guess let's go to the sewers. Um, let me go back and ask them where they are. Welcome back. You're not the you're you. not the guy big enough. It's a liquor store. Screw it. Let's get this is freaking walk around. I want to go to the sewers. Is this the air? Oh, this is something. What is this? That's oh, just the Mojave Wasteland. Patrolling the Mojave I almost makes you wish for a nuclear winter. Right, guys? I'm glad mean son of a bitch is on our side. Huh. I think it's outside for the freaking gang is. Same with the feed, so I don't think they're in the town. What is this? Just mailboxes. Well, let's go in here. Is there a door I haven't gone to? North cistern. 
Mammoth Blob Flick Explorer. No, we've been everywhere here. Alright, silver time. T-M-N-T. No, T-U-R-T-L-E power. T-U-R-T-L-E power. Okay. I've never been here. I never knew it was like a sewer area you could access. It looks huge too. And it has multiple dead ends apparently. North Vegas Square? Hi everyone. Alright, I wasn't expecting that. Holy hell, this place is goddamn huge. Howdy. Okay, well, there's fiends somewhere in the western part of the sewers, apparently. Yeah, what do you want? I never knew there was a whole underground sewer system. It is huge. Oh my god. And people are just walking around. Hey there. This is actually really cool. We are great to central sewers. There's a central sewers? What is that? We got rats and ghouls? A dead body? Bottle cap. Nail board, that's new. Purified water, sure. Ashtray, purified water. Oh, Tales of Chivalry. That's interesting. A key. Alright. Oh, oh my god. That already completed a challenge for killing a rat. Over here. Blind Luke. Luke's fine. Okay. But well, we got two keys now. God only knows where we're supposed to use them. Hi. I killed the baby rot. Yeah. Yeah. Did that give me good karma? That's more. It's just full of wrath and ghouls. Animal control perk, okay. Kinda lost. Uh, uh, what's over here? Have I been here? What is this? Is this where I came from? I think it's where I came from, isn't it? Yes, I think it is. So there's a north sewers and there's a west sewers where apparently the fiends are hanging out? No, that's where it came from. This place is huge. Oh, we found more ghouls. The 
the rolling one. More like a dead one now. Okay, just there we go. Another key. What's this? Advanced radiation suit. Interesting. Oh, I see a plasma weapon. Where is it? Oh. Wait, it's advanced, but 10 DT, 6 DT, and has 40 resistance. This is a unique weapon. Is it? Multi plas rifle? I don't remember ever seeing this weapon. Because I've never been down here. Alright. Like, give me a freaking refresh. Better give me a goddamn refresh. I'm at it, that doesn't count. That removed. I'm glad you gave me all these dud removals, but no refresh. Damn it. Anything else around here besides a computer? No. Let me pop it right away. Close to lovely. Barney! Forget. the lovely. I did Barney. Oh, there's only two choices yet left. Yeah, there we go. Central sewer control. Alright, well I did something to the sewers. I don't know what the hell I did. Oh my god. It's your guys. Wish I had a first recon guy looking after me. Oh, it's the Camp McCarran. We can actually go to Camp McCarran now. I didn't expect it to be a giant sewer system that late links to areas all across the freaking Mojave. That's a raider. Who and where are you? Oh. Hey, it's a lot of you guys. You like to <laughs> You like to boom. I think it bonked his head. Are you not taking damage right now? You freaking hacker? There we go. You like the sight of your own blood? Oh, I got up to level up, so that's great. Alright. Let's get repair up. Okay. Uh. 
this area is huge. I don't know where to go. I don't know where I'm supposed to use those freaking keys. Oh, I did have the light on. Bottle cap. Okay, that's where I came from. What's over here? I don't know why I walked up here, but it's clearly a dead end, but I walked up here anyways. But it's down here. I don't even know what places I've been to, what places I haven't been to. What's here? Enemies. Why are there so many rats? My light isn't doing crap for me right now. Now where am I? I am so lost. I just want to know where this key goes. That's the second floor to the sewers? No, there isn't. What's the point of this room? Oh, can I go in there? I cannot. Is this a pointless room that's pointless? I think it is. Yes, it's a pointless room that's pointless. That's the local map. Holy hell. Have I been here? Sealed sewers? I swear there's a door I'm missing somewhere. I do want to go to the sealed sewers though. What's this place? I gotta just start dragging dead rats to mark where I've been. What's in front of me? It's just a dead end in front of me, isn't it? Yes, it is. Where's that door I found? What's this? Is this connected to the same door? Same area as the other door? No, these are the east central. Okay. I wanna go here, to the sealed sewers. I am so lost. If I go straight, it'll take a left. Who knew I would be exploring a giant sewer system today? I, like I said before, multiple times, I never knew this existed. Ever. Alright, so through here. Oh, it's where I killed the fiends. Or raiders, whatever. Fiends, fiends. They're the same thing. They're just freaking victims from my katana. Where's the door? Over here. All right, what's here? A bunch of friends, apparently. A whole bunch of friends. Whoa, what is that cool? It's a reaver. Oh, he hurts. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta get rid of you. You got them hurt. Thank you, Boone. That was close. That's the Reaver. That's all you had? Also, he's dabbing.
Whoa, about to get boot me. I gained good karma, apparently. Prospector. Bottle cap, desperado, cowboy helmet, right away. The humble cudgel. It's just a better... It's a named... Uh, pipe. Yeah, it's just a named pipe. Well, I mean... Nice well. Did that really just say it costs a thousand? Combat armor... Ooh. I bought some good shit. Oh, but I have Mark 2. Oh, but I can fix it with Mark 1. Let's go. What is so heavy? Oh, the fire axe, which I could use now for chop. Uh, L. You have a boon. Alright, you come here. It's fine by me. Hold on to that. Uh. I think the cudgel weighs more than a regular cudgel. I mean, regular pipe. Anything else around here? Is this where the the key led to? Inaccessible. I guess so. All right, let's go. Oh, are you kidding me? Beans. Uh, there. All right. Uh, let's explore the east side of the sewer then. Which is in front of me, and then to the right, and then up. And I guess we could try going to Camp McCarran now, since we found a way to get into Camp McCarran. But I am an idiot, and I don't know how to get there properly. Should it be in front of me? Yeah. Wait, is that the right door? Yes, 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 it is. Yeah, it's a whole new section. I'm just killing rats like nothing. I like that these rats give two experience, but then the giant ones give like, what, 50 something? The ones that freaking killed me? Ooh. Mission box. Damn it. Oh. Did he just jump over my katana swing? I'm actually surprised it didn't hide a, um, what's it called? A snow globe down in the sewers. I feel like that would be a perfect place to hide one. Why am I gaining karma for killing ghouls? Really? At least it up. Wow. Yeah, no, this place is crazy. I wanna know why I'm getting karma for killing them. Is it because they're insane and I'm setting them free for their pain or Sweet Joe. Lead pipe looks fine. Another looks fine key. I just realized whatever that is is not a ghoul. Oh No, it's one of the super rats! Squeeze through here? I can't. Or can I? Come on. No, I can't. I didn't expect them to be in here.
Okay. Let's just ignore that. I don't know why that texture is doing that right now, but it's fine. It's not hurting my eyes, not at all. So we're great to the Mojave Wasteland. Still an upper area. Alright, we'll do this and we can finally head to Camp McCarran. The next time we play, which is Friday, we should be able to finally get into New Vegas after so freaking long. Where the hell does this lead? It does, actually, okay. Where the hell does this go? Okay, it connects to the north sewers. This place is so fucking weird. Probably connected to North Sewers too. No, we'll have a wasteland, okay. What's that? Where are you, buddy? Are you just a wanderer just chilling? Someone finally put down that sick oh motor runner son of a bitch. Good riddance. You're welcome. Alright, let's get to the ladder that leads to uh, Camp McCarran. Is that what it is? Where's this go? I haven't even looked at this ladder. NCR sharecroppers. The area that has nothing for me to do at. Like, I have nothing there. the door. Should be close by. If I leveled up and I found a way to camp a Karen, so it's worth coming down to the sewers. Camp a Karen ladder should be over here, right? Uh, I think it's this one. Wherever the NCR guys are chilling. Yeah, it should be this one. Yep. Glad you're with us. And here we are. Um. Wait, what? So that- you told me I was going around New Vegas the entire time? Wait, and there's the whole t oh my- Wait. That makes no sense. Wait, 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 wait. I- I'm gonna look through the vault. Did I really walk past the door this entire time? It was to my right? I did. I really did. Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. This entire time it was to my right. We're going here. Lovely. Ranger at the ready. Alright, Boone, how's the feel to come back to Camp McCarran? I'm sure you've been here before, right? What is it? Were you at Bitter Springs as the first recall? I was in a lot of play. Okay. All right, well, I'm sure there's quests that we could do here. Seriously. All right, let's look for look uh, important looking people. 
Why is she following me? But I can't shoot. Well, I mean, I got the grenade rifle. Are you the one I called with the radio? Have you been here this entire time? I was wondering where she ran to when we freaking called her and she just disappeared. Anyone important anywhere? Wish I had a first recon guy. Sergeant Bitter Root. First recon. You got a reason to talk to me? Bitter Root, you have an unusual name. You trying to start trouble? Or do you really not know where I got that name? I didn't mean to offend. You don't have to tell me if you'd rather not. It's a con name. You know, the great cons. That's what my parents were. Oh. I figured I grew up around the bastards. They owed me a name after all they put me through. What happened to your parents? They're dead. Got themselves killed at Bitter Springs. Served them right if you ask me. Damn, homie. Tell me about what happened at Bitter Springs. It was a massacre. That's what a lot of NCR folk will tell you. Most of them feel plenty bad about what happened. But I was there. Saw it myself. I don't care what anybody says. The cons asked for Bitter Springs. They wouldn't leave the NCRB. Okay. My damn parents, too. They were just as bad as the rest. You don't already mean that, do you? Don't I? Beg pardon, ma'am, but you never met my parents. My dad he got himself fucked up every chance he got. Always started with foe for no reason. Hell, he was the one who taught me to shoot. You know how? By taking pot shots at NCR and not wow. just soldiers. Okay. Civilians too. Even kids. Then he'd get high with his buddies and swap tales about the folk they killed. Bunch of animals. Jesus Christ. And my mom? A couple of times she tried to sell me to some waster just to score some jet. Jesus. Even the other cons said she was useless. Only reason they kept her around was because she was a <clears throat> how'd my dad say it? smoking piece of ass okay your name it comes from bitter springs you're not fully grown till you've taken a beat down everybody gathers around and hits you till you're damn near dead after that if you haven't begged for mercy you get to choose a new name one you'll use for the rest of your life when ncr slaughtered the cons of bitter springs i hadn't got my beat down yet i was still too young the way i see it bitter springs was my beat down so afterward I gave myself a name. It's all I got from the cons. Damn, homie. It's all I ever want. How did you survive the massacre? Guess I could tell a pretty good story if I had a mind. But the truth is, I don't know. I just got lucky. They brought me to Daughtry after the battle. He was just a captain back then. Guess he saw something in me. He knew I didn't belong with the cons. Maybe he felt bad, too, about how his men killed my folks. I told him he did me a service, but he didn't believe me. Still doesn't. He's a good man, Daughtry. Doesn't act like it sometimes, I know. But he didn't have to take me in. You're not telling me something. You couldn't have forgotten the whole massacre. It's like I tell Major Daughtry. Best not to look under a rock if you don't really want to know what's there. Could be that NCR found some blood on me and none of it mine. Could be that a few of those cons didn't die from NCR bullets. Damn. I had scores of my own to settle deeper ones than NCR ever had. Don't bother asking who they were with. Wow. Yeah, that's probably best. Not too friendly, are you? How long have you been with the first recon? While, I guess. I don't keep too careful track of time. I like to keep things simple. Just focus on now. That's why they made me a sniper. You let your mind wander back a ways and you lose sight of what's in front of your eyes. Good way to miss a mark. Father is commanding. Your father is. Your father is your commanding officer. Is that allowed? Yeah. Look, he's not my real father. He just looked after me for a while. It's a long story. And I get tired of talking before it was through. Is that allowed? It's like I told you, Dotri's not my real father. Where can I find some work around here? You a merc? Ow. And then I guess you want to talk to my uh, father, Major Dotri. He's our CO. Not too friendly, are you? Guess not. I don't mean nothing by it. You really want to talk to somebody, try ten of spades. Ten of spades? He's always got plenty to say. 
Me? I'm here to do my job. For now, that job is shooting fiends. All right. All right. Wish I had a first time guy looking after me. Yeah, nothing to say about that, Boone. I think you both have been traumatized. Nelson's back in our hands. I hope we can defend it this time. Oh, that's a whole bunch of people we could talk to here. Okay. Let me save. Pause. I'll be right back. I don't want to come back. We have a bunch of people to talk to. So that's great. All right, we are back. I can move the table a tiny bit. Yeah. All right. Where is the controller? Here it is. All right, I hope you guys are ready for a talkathon because we have a bunch of people to talk to right now. Hey there, miss. Ten of spades. First recon sharpshooter at your surface. Okay, you got a stutter. Are you all right? Oh, yeah. F fine. Just a little... Stutter. Had it since I was a kid. Doesn't stop me from kicking ass. I'm sure it does it. Are you sh no, are you I'm sure it doesn't. Damn right. Where did you get that name? The LT. Goral Betts gave it to me. See, I wanted to be Ace of Spades. But the LT says, sorry kid, you're t t t too green. So he calls me Tin instead. Oh, that's actually pretty funny. It's okay though. <laughs> I get a few more kills under my belt he'll move me up to jack jack of spades sounds better right i keep at it eventually i'll make it to ace i think i'll skip queen though all right how long have you been a sharpshooter shit as long as i can remember had a rifle in my hand since i was three that's what my dad always says learned to shoot on our ramp way west of here same as the lt he's a f f f farm kid too all right, when did you enlist in the military? Oh, 
They recruited me, what, a year ago? Taught me to kick even more ass than before. These guys, they really know how to kick some ass. What happened to your stutter? What do you do around here? Kicking ass. Mostly kicking ass. See, we're watching the perimeter right now. Looking for those fiends to come back. When they show their faces, that's when we go to work. One shot, one k k kill. That's the first recon way. Alright. Let's turn to spades. We got Gorobets? I'm Lieutenant Gorobets, first recon. If you're looking to collect a bounty, you should talk to Major Daughtry. Tell me about the first recon. We're the finest sniper outfit in the whole NCR. If you need a bullet put into a target's eye from 800 yards away, you call us. Some of my team aren't without their share of scars, though, like Betsy and Sterling. Boone, do you have anything to say? They're literally your people. Cook Cook, one of the fiends, ambushed her and ten of spades. They both managed to escape, but not before Cook Cook raped her. Jesus. Betsy shrugged it off like it was nothing, but her behavior keeps getting worse. Always making passes at every woman who wanders by. It's inappropriate for anyone at First Recon to behave that way. I could discipline her, but I'd rather she get medical help. Talk to Betsy about getting medical help for her trauma if you want. I'd appreciate it. As her CO, I could order her to get help, but I'd have her agree with the idea. What happened to Sterling? Corporal Sterling was an NCR Ranger until he was captured by the Legion. They tortured him pretty badly. He wasn't able to be a Ranger after that, but his eyes are still sharp, so I had him transferred to First Recon. Tell me about First Recon. We had the finest sniper outfit in the Wait, you already told me this. The NCR usually offer bounties on people. If they've proven hard to kill, yes. Whatever it takes to get the job done, even if it means hiring help from outside the military. All right. I hear you took care. Oh, it's you. Wish I had a first recon guy looking after me. Corporal Sterling. Howdy. Name Sterling, first recon. Can't say I've seen you before. I'd remember if I had. You remember everyone who passed through here? Got a good memory for faces, landmarks, and such too. Comes with practice, that's all, and a lot of scouting from place to place. Interesting rifle, rifle you have there. Yeah, it looks pretty good, honestly. Lever action, right? I call her the Long Caribbean. Didn't always have the scope. I added that myself. Been shooting with her so long, couldn't bring myself to toss her away. Would have felt guilty to part with the old girl. The other snipers used bolt action, but Gorbets reckoned it didn't matter none if I was different. So long as I could hit my targets. That's true. He always been with the first recon. Used to be a ranger. One of the first they sent out east back before we took the dam. Observation and reconnaissance. We took the lay of the land, checked out the locals, and kept ourselves inconspicuous. A couple friends of mine were the first to scout the dam. That was back in 73, if I recall. A lot of those rangers are dead now. Vegas always chewed men up. It's just a little more literal nowadays. Huh. Why did you leave the rangers? Well, that wasn't really a matter of choice. Got myself caught by legionaries up near Malpe. They had themselves some fun with me. Mangled my hands and feet pretty good. Wasn't much good with the pistol after that. Wasn't going to be trekking across the waist on any more long scouts either. Haven't you managed to escape Malpais? Malpais? Caesar's boys figured I wasn't going anywhere after what they'd done to me. So they didn't bother tying me up. I crawled out of there on my elbows and knees. Must have looked a sight. Then I rolled down an embankment into the Colorado. I guess I had a mind to drown rather than give Caesar's boys the satisfaction of killing me. But a couple rangers happened to be watching from across the river. They jumped on in and pulled me out of there. Lucky break, they said. Nice. How long have you been stationed here? Going on six months now. But I reckon we'll be moving out soon enough. Can't talk about the details. Till then, we'll man the towers and keep an eye on the fiends. We've had more than our share of trouble from their direction. Whole thing smells of Caesar to me. Of course, that's just guesswork. But I'd still bet a few caps he's stirring up the locals against us. All right. Oh, here's Betsy. Save just in case I need a speech check. Hey, girl. You need something from me? Should get medical help for your trauma. I thought you should know Cook. Have you seen any serious combat around here? Not unless you count the fiends as serious. Gorobets keeps us inside the fence most of the time. Doesn't matter to me. I just shoot bad guys. Sooner or later, they'll move us out to the dam, though. 
That's when the shit gets nasty. Uh, nasty how? Legion fights to win, and they're smart. Hell of a lot smarter than these crazy fiends. But I don't feel bad about shooting Legion boys. Fiends, on the other hand, sometimes I get pangs of conscience. Not often, but sometimes. For there are about conscience in the wild. Some cute little junkie bitch, so fucked up she doesn't even know that she's the bad guy. And I've got a headshot her. Makes me think. Might just be sex, though. I see some cute little number, and I'd rather get in her pants. So maybe I'm a stone-cold bitch after all. Okay, you're a sniper? What gave me away? The big gun? The shades? Or the attitude? They're not all snipers that wear shades. They don't. Only the good ones do. Damn, Boone's My partner's shit. got some potential, so I let him wear those goofy glasses. I tell him there is training shades. He totally buys it. <laughs> Truth is, his eyes just suck. Nice. Who's your partner? The little guy. Ten of spades. I like him because he listens. Doesn't shut up the rest of the time, but when I talk, he listens. Also, he doesn't pull any stupid come-ons, like practically every other horn dog alpha male on this base. Might be, he's just scared of me, though. Okay. So snipers work in Paris? Yeah. We spot for each other, watch each other's backs. Usually works pretty well, unless you get paired up with an asshole. Thing is, there's a lot of assholes in the army. I keep hoping they'll pair me up with some hot blonde like you see on those old pinups. Shit, I don't even care if she can shoot straight. Can't have everything. Should get some medical help for your trauma. The lieutenant's been talking to you, hasn't he? Look, I don't need a head doctor. I'm first recon, damn it. You don't see the others crying about every little bruise and scrape, do you? Mental trauma could slow you down or distract you, but it's treatable. Just like any bullet wound. Just another injury to take care of, huh? Well, when you put it that way. All right. You can tell the lieutenant I finally caved. There's a Dr. Usanagi who's supposed to be good at this sort of thing. Kind of Gor Korobeth and Corporal Bessie with everything treatment. I thought you should know Cook Cook is dead. You killed him? Well, shit. Here I dreamed up this whole elaborate revenge fantasy. Didn't really think I'd do it, but as long as the tubby bastard was actually alive, I could pretend like I would. Here, I owe you. Take it and get out of here. Before I indulge my inner bitch and spoil the moment. Wow. Hello. Corporal Sterling, I see a ranger. Bitter root. Is that everybody? I think I talked to everybody. What can I do for you? you Convince Betsy. I wish someone with your medical training had come along sooner. I think she'll actually stick with the treatment because of what she said. I was afraid that Betsy wouldn't go for long-term treatment because she didn't want to look bad in front of the rest of the squad. You settled that. Do me a favor and let Ustanagi know Corporal Betsy is coming. I'd like to make sure the medical clinic has time for her. All right. Where is this Usanagi? This isn't the first time I've heard her name. Oh, she's at the New Vegas Medical Clinic. Okay. Even. Oh, that will be for a little while. And by a little while, I mean next time. Guy looking after me. I hear you took care of Motorway. I could have handled that on my own. I want to know who he is and why he has a name. I think that's everyone important that's outside. I don't think there would be anyone else important. Yeah, I know. I think I have a permanent sound of metal dropping because I have 50 freaking sheaths in my my freaking waist right now. Yeah, I know. That's just going to stick with me forever. God damn it. I'd rather have my katana be permanently visible than deal with this noise forever. Oh. They have a lot of crap. Are you the one that killed Motor Runner? Yes. Thank God. Thank God it was a living nightmare. Alright, well, let's go inside. I think there is a quest to get inside. Maybe multiple, too, for all I know. This place is dark as hell. Hi, Boone. Anders showed up here not too long ago. I'm told you're the one who got him out of the vault. Can't tell you how relieved I am. 
sending him on that mission was a mistake. Are you talking about the one with Cook Cook? I don't know he was in the vault, but don't say how you could be so careless as a life arranging. Ranger. Do the right thing if you sent more to have been killed. They have a choice. The feasts are growing. Yeah, they were a threat. That's probably true, but I wonder if I should have taken a different strategy entirely. Although my options were certainly limited, with most of our forces tied up garrisoning this place. Regardless, what you did for Anders isn't something he or any of us around here take lightly. We're all glad to have him back. Thank you. Nice. He had to fight the poor, so anything I might be able to help with. Hmm. You don't cook by any chance, do you? Farber's doing his best, but it's hard to manage an army with half my staff in line for the latrine. Honestly, we're fighting a lot of fires right now. The fiends keep pressing their position from Vault 3. I killed him. We've got the Legion breathing down our necks across the river. We actually took an officer alive last week, but so far he hasn't spoken a word. Any other problems? Yeah. On top of everything else, I can't send a patrol on a bathroom break without it being ambushed by someone who heard they were coming. So somebody's getting the word out. Hmm. Some calm given that things are as bad as they are. Calm is what you have to be when people look to you. And it's all you can be when things are out of your hands. Motor runner is dead. I bought his helmet as proof. Unbelievable. That man has given us so much grief since we set up here. This may be a major turning point for us. I can't tell you how many times we thought we'd taken him out, only to have him show up again later, taking more heads off of fallen troopers. This is for the bounty. And this is from a pool me and a lot of the soldiers around the base had going. You may not be in CR, but hey, it's only fair. Wow. Ooh. Yay, that's your likes me. Ooh, and are you happy? That's a smile, you know that's a smile. We're all impressed with the work you've done for us. It's a key to a little hideaway south of here. We've used it as a place for rangers to rest and resupply. I thought you might get good use out of it. Okay. Look into who's leaking into your intelligence. Things mostly quiet between here and the dam. Yeah, go look into who's leaking into your intelligence. Hmm. Well, why not? Given your recent arrival, at least I can safely rule you out as the leak. I'd like to have absolute trust in my men, but that's just not practical right now. Go ahead and look into it. See what you find. We don't have much to go on right now. Lately, every raiding party in New Vegas seems to have a map of our troop movements. It derails everything. Supplies, reinforcements. And it'll only get worse the longer we let it go on. Captain Curtis is heading up the investigation right now. He can fill you in. All right. Put a spell on you. Alright. Do that quest. Can't complete the other one because we gotta go to New Vegas. Which we won't do until next time. Well, it's either in New Vegas or like around. The shadow world. I wanna go gambling here. Dean Domino. Okay, so what are these other rooms? Oh, bathrooms, clearly. And accessible. Lovely. What? Nice to meet you. I'm Curtis. Colonel Sue wants me to help you look into the recent intelligence leaks. Smart man. I could use somebody who can operate under the radar around here. Whoever our mole is, he's been slippery. Whenever one of the MPs gets too close, he changes his habits. Our last leak went cold weeks ago. Where should I start? You want my advice? Start by talking to people with a lot of eyes in the field. People like Lieutenant Boyd or Sergeant Contreras, maybe. Careful with Contreras, though. He's not above suspicion himself. Keep me apprised of any leads you get. This guy's gotten a lot of my men killed. I'm just itching to return the favor. But should I be talking? What do you do here? Officially, I'm in charge of Bravo Company. But since General Oliver has Bravo and most of our forces here garrisoned, I'm free to do other things. So I work with Colonel Shu on logistics, oh, shoot. patrols, okay. supply lines, reinforcements, that sort of thing. Lately, it's been less about that, and more about figuring out how that information is getting leaked to raiders. It's a big base with a lot of unhappy soldiers. They get stir-crazy. Hard to separate the malcontents from the actual culprit. All right. Let's go talk to people, I guess. What? Is that upstairs, or is he behind the door I can't go into? I think it's upstairs. 
Boyd's in there with a the prisoner right now. Boy, is she pissed. Boyd's in there with a the prisoner right now. Boy, is she pissed. All right. You still got like a sore thumb around here. You sure you're in the right place? Hi, Lucina. Who are you? Not big on reading name tags, huh? That's okay. My name is long and difficult. Wait, that is her! <laughs> it's Boyd. Lieutenant Boyd to my friends. Colonel Shu has me handling the policing duties for the base. I've told him he could make my job a whole lot easier if he would just let me shoot anyone who talks back to me. But you know how colonels can be. If you notice anything suspicious lately. Now what kind of MP would I be if I didn't notice anything suspicious? I've had soldiers go AWOL, break-ins, thefts, you name it. Who's missing? Well, there's Anders. I He's saved a him. Ranger. That one's not suspicious so much as worried. Colonel Shu sent him out. I saved him, it's fine. What can you tell me about Anders? I don't know him very well myself. I seem to remember that he was the man to Colonel Sh Yeah, I read that. Oh, uh, tell me about the break-ins. Maybe break-in isn't the right word. We didn't find signs of forced entry, but I've had reports of someone sneaking into the control tower at night. It's probably just a meeting spot for a steamy military base love affair. <sighs> Kids today. Mm -hmm. But it bothers me that they didn't break in. It means they have an access code. Most soldiers around the base don't have that. Would you be willing to give me the control tower access key so I can check it out? Sure, if you want to investigate. It's not like there's anything to steal up there. Just a bunch of old communications equipment. If you can find out any more, I'd be interested to hear it. There's something about this I really don't like. And if I weren't tied up here, I'd be staking it out personally. You said they're a bit fast? Not the kind of things you like to see go missing. No witnesses yet. I've got my money on Sergeant Contreras, who's supposed to be in charge of distribution, the little weasel. But he's too slick to let anyone catch him doing it. We've searched his possessions a dozen times. Nothing. Okay. Keep an eye out for your missing supplies. Good. The more guns you can recover, the more I'll be able to use to shoot Contreras for being inept. Do you need any help? I'll do this later. Her, her thingy. Alright. Where's the tower? Over there. There's a whole bunch of garbage here. Hello. Hello there. Concourse. What is in here? Nothing. Lovely. What's over here? Go right ahead, Cooper. You ought to think about enlisting. We need you here. Alright, well, let's go later. Uh. This place is a lot bigger than I remember it being, honestly. Or is it because I'm slower? I feel like I'm just because I'm slower. Hey, where is the tower? Is it, I think it's downstairs. It's downstairs. What's over here, though? I don't know what's here. Contreras is holding out on me. I know you don't. What is concourse? What is this place? This place is huge. Wait, is this where I can just gamble? I have no idea. Oh, we'll come back. Let's do that tower thing first. If I can gamble there, I might as well try. Get a little bit of money. Alright, downstairs we go. But where? It's a whole other section of the Camp Karen. Alright. This place really is way bigger than I remember. Can I stop with these noises, please? Oh, there's the tower. Is there anything else to this place? I don't think there is. Just people over here? Oh, it must be up there. Alright. I could just use the key.
If I have to get the late night break ins, I can't be carrying control tower. How late at night? I don't even know what time it is around. Oh, it has to be late, late. Question is how late? These goddamn noises. Lupa, this is Frumentarius Picus. Over. Go ahead, Picus. Afternoon patrol enters Fiend territory at 1300. Have them mind that stretch. 10 4, Picus. Fiends will be alerted. Roger, Lupa. Uh huh. The status of your primary mission, Picus. Charges are set. Detonation will occur as the train leaves the station. Oh! How long? Couple of minutes. Over. 10-4. Keep us updated. 10-4. Well, we got some bombs to defuse, apparently. Oh, no. Am I not going to have enough... I don't think I'm going to have enough explosion skill to deal with it, am I? I can already see it now. These freaking noises. Got a bomb, we got a bomb, we got a bomb. Oh my god, all the katana sheets. Calling it right now, I can't defuse the bombs. Where are they? Oh, good. Okay, good. I was really scared I wouldn't be able to defuse the bombs. Because I can have science high enough. What? Oh, he's downstairs. Yes, what is it? Don't be having problems with intelligence leaks anymore. No? What happened? With Curtis. He's the, he's in the Legion. I can prove he tried to blow up the monorail. Curtis? He's been in the NCR long before our conflict with the Legion. There's just no way. I hope you're mistaken, but somehow I don't think so. It explained a lot. This is much worse than anyone expected. There could be others, too. You've done everything that was asked of you. You have my personal thanks for this. I'll make sure you receive the credit you deserve. I'll have Curtis taken into custody. Yeah. If he lets himself be taken alive, that is. All right, let's go. We did it, Boone. Why is Boone gonna give me his quest? I'm really shocked he hasn't given me his quest yet. Where's the dirty water? Like, I gotta hurry up with your quest, buddy, so I can do everyone else's quest. Yes, what is it? Uh, the challenge of the NCR face here. Everything was going according to President Campbell's plan at first. We met minor resistance from local troublemakers. But our two main objectives are still contested. Mr. House controls the Strip and he won't so much as meet with our ambassador. And we're holding Hoover Dam. But Caesar's Legion is positioning itself to overrun it. If it falls, so will New Vegas. We'd be forced to withdraw. All right. Better to make the Legion present I have Lieutenant Boyd on that already and she's excellent. But I think she's hit a wall. Talk to her if you like. See if she has any use for you. Her office is right above mine, but I think she might be interrogating right now. So she'd be upstairs. Yeah, yeah. Alright, let's go help her. There's another corporal or lieutenant somewhere I haven't talked to. Who are you? A little busy at the moment, but I can talk. Uh, what is this place? This? The OSI lab. We don't get many visitors. The smell puts people off, I think. Okay. Nobody ever said science would smell clean and fresh. Anyway, you get used to it if you give it some time. Are you a scientist? I know, I don't sound the part. 
Get raised by Brahmin ranchers and you never lose the twang. Drives Hildern crazy. But I know every inch of the power grid from Hoover Dam to Shady Sands. That's what we do here. Try to optimize the power output from the dam. Some of the others are working on an agricultural project, but truth be told, they aren't making much progress. Not yet, anyway. All right, what's your role? Head researcher. Mostly on the dam project, but I help out on other... Oh, then we just get protects. Do you help with anything? You mean, give you work? No, that'd be up to the administrator, Hildern. He's back there in his office. Between you and me, I don't think he ever leaves. Plenty of mercs go in to see him, though. Mercenaries? What for? I can't say. We're not supposed to talk about the research. Not the details. If you're interested, I'm sure he'd see you. All right. Is it you? Yeah. A pleasure to meet you. I'm Dr. Thomas Hildern, Director of Operations, OSI East. I presume you're here about Vault 22? Vault 22? Uh, lie. Wonderful. Straight <coughs> down. <coughs> Have you signed the release forms? No? Doesn't matter. We'll keep that to ourselves. Vault 22. Where to begin? I'm listening. Imagine, if you will, the wasteland in bloom. Vast fields of corn that grow from seeds and produce their bounty in the space of a month. I'm not the gek. Orchards of trees. Their branches weighed halfway to the ground, hung with fat, ripe oranges. A harvest that could feed a city or a nation. Yes, I'm not the gek, right? And all of this, all this, requiring no more than a few drops of precious water and the efforts of only a handful of human farmers. Impossible? Uh, nothing's impossible. Precisely. Science has proven that truth a thousand times. Science! Over. But how many wasteland savages believe it? Present company accepted, of course. The bounty I describe to you is no idle fantasy. It exists in primitive form only a few miles from where we stand. We need only reach out and unlock its secret. For that, the OSI needs you. Okay. What do you need me to do? I believe that the inhabitants of Vault 22 unlock the secrets of vegetative growth. Plants are spilling from their gate. No one tends them. No one waters them. Yet they multiply and spread in all directions. Find the reason for this miraculous growth, and I promise you the OSI will see that you are generously compensated. All right. Good. No need to check in with the NCR authorities. I can authorize your payment from OSI accounts. Vaults typically contain a server what room is an at OSI? Low level where they would have backed up their research data. A computer room, you understand? Download all the information on the central server to your pip boy, and you'll be certain to bring me any notes or samples that you find, won't you? Anything else I should know? I thought it was a fairly straightforward assignment. It's a simple question of retrieving the data, which shouldn't prove overly challenging. Downloading the data will be handled by your pip boy. You might think of yourself as a mere means of conveyance. Uh, no insult intended, of course. Okay. Best of luck to you. Not that you'll need it. All right, well, now we know the location of a vault and a quest. Did Dr. Hildern... This really isn't any of my business, but... Did he give you a job? Yes, he told me to get some data. I shouldn't say anything. I know that. But you're not the first person Hildern sent out to the vault. There were a lot of mercs. One after another. None of them came back. Then, about a week ago, there was a scientist, Keeley. She's unusual. Not the sort of person you'd expect, but she's an absolute genius, and... And he didn't mention her? Not even her name? Or any of the other mercs? No, he didn't. But now he's hired you, which means one of two things. Either he heard back from Keeley, and she failed, or he's given up on her. Listen, I make a fair wage, but I'm not rich. Not by any means. Maybe my kind of money wouldn't appeal to your average merc, but I'm willing to pay you if you'll find Keeley and make sure she's safe. Okay. In right leaving her out there. No idea if she's alive or dead. Sure, why not? I had a good feeling about you. Moment you walked in. I mean it. Right. Optional. Find Keeley. Alright, let's go beat up the Legion dude that's upstairs. I want to know what that other co corporal is. We uh, won't go quietly. The Legion can speed. count on that. So I gotta go one v one with this Legion dude. 
You're back. Do you need any help? Yeah. So far, this has gone exactly as expected. Poorly. But with the work you've done for NCR already, you might be just what I've been looking for. Am I? We captured an honest-to-god centurion of Caesar's legion recently. Okay, is that, is that a big deal? Better believe it. Everybody. Everybody in Caesar's legion from Caesar on down will kill themselves before they can be captured. They're so twitchy they'd probably do it if you reached out to hug them. But here's this guy, who's an elite commander in their army and he just gives himself up. Even as his men are slitting their own throats around him. What do you think it means? Well, I don't know about you, but to me, that sounds like a man who's willing to cooperate. Except he hasn't. Only times he speaks up are to insult you. Nice. He's a real prick, by the way. And I'm supposed to get information out of this guy. Why don't you just beat your prisoner senseless? What about the truth drug? Have you tried calling him hurtful names? Yes. And one time, I thought I saw a tear when I told him his uniform was unflattering. But I think he's got some <laughs> dust in his eye. But he just beat him. I like the way you think. Have I said that yet? Problem is that the NCR frowns on using that sort of tactic. There are some restrictions still in place from President Tandy's administration. But here's my favorite thing about you. You're not in the NCR. That's true. Plus, for all this guy knows, you're completely insane. That's a winning combination. All right, so you want me to do what you can't. I think if you rough him up enough and really put some fear into him, he'll sing like a choir boy. So let's do this. When you're ready, I'll go in and give you a little intro. Then I leave the room and you make him regret the day he was born. We go back and forth a couple times until either he talks or he can't move his jaw anymore. Either way, we've had our entertainment for the day. All right, I'm fine with this. Let's get started. That's the spirit. Okay, I'll go in and have a word with him. Then I'll call you in. You're about to cash these hands on me. Long time no see, Silus. Lieutenant. I was just thinking about you. That's so. I was. I was just thinking about that pretty neck of yours. Okay. How sweet. I was thinking about how it would look with a legion slave collar on it. I'll pass. She's smoking in the freaking room. You know what I love about our slave collars, Lieutenant? If you love them, maybe you should try one on. I love how tight they fit. I train my men to make sure the slave's flesh bulges a bit around the top and bottom. Know why? It's all the rage in fashion circles? Not quite. If you fit it just right, their body never gets used to the feeling of wearing it. Okay. It cuts in just enough when they swallow or turn their head to remind them who they belong to. And it's that constant reminder that keeps them docile. Okay, buddy. In that case, maybe you'd better save the collar you were going to give me. Oh? For whom? For a friend of mine you're about to meet. My friend isn't very docile. And who is this friend of yours? You know all the rules the NCR instituted to protect enemies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me at him. War? Let me at him. Of course. Let me at him. My friend doesn't. <laughs> oh, and Silus, if you resist at all, I'll personally blow your brains out. Ah! Come on in. He's all yours. I'll be back in a bit to see how you're getting along. And I need you to surrender your weapons before you go in. You can pick them up from the locker on your way out. Oh, it just does it for me automatically. Okay. What an ugly little worm you are. What you what mean? Pile of excrement did the lieutenant pluck you from, worm? You smell like excrement, so there. I must admit that a conversation with an imbecile may be far worse than the kind of torture I was anticipating. <laughs> but somehow I think I'll manage. You're about to tell me everything you know, Silas. Of course, of course. All you had to do was ask. I'll tell you everything I know. Let's see. I know that you're a brainless cretin. I know that you're wasting your time. Oh my god, this I know dude. the lieutenant is going to be disappointed in you. And I know that by this time next month, the streets of New Vegas will be decorated with the decaying heads of NCR soldiers. Is there anything else you wanted to know? Okay, homie. Time to get beat up. I can take anything you've got. Can you? But you can't take this. Oh my. Oh, shit. Can't run from me. You like that? You like jazz? Yeah? Yeah? 
You fuck! Um, hit me. Hit me once. No? You already fucked, dude. Can't run from me. Yeah, you can't run from Boone. Had enough. You really fucked, dude. You're not even gonna fight back? You're just gonna you're just gonna let me do this to you? Yeah? Can't run from me. <laughs> the best you got? That's the best you got? Come here. You done yet? You've become one with the wall. Oh! Oh, hi. I'm not gonna land on him because he, cause he doesn't actually want to fight. There we go. Right, you can stop for a sec. Whoa, easy there. You're supposed to rough him up a little. Get away from him. me. Why don't you step outside a minute? Let off. Some <laughs> nice job. I think my friend doesn't like. I can get you, things. homie. I don't know how much longer I can keep her under control. You think this will make me talk? A beating. This is the best you can do. Yeah! Not just any beating, Silus. <laughs> a savage beating. A beating that you'll be reminded of every time you feel pain from now on. Yeah, exactly. When my friend's done with you, you won't have any of your teeth left. You'll be drinking your food through a straw. Your ribs will never heal properly, yeah! and it will hurt every time you breathe. Beat your ass on me. It'll be like your collars, Silus. Impossible to forget. Go to hell. Wow. Not the sort of wit I've come to expect from you, Silus. You're getting nothing from me. Okay, no sympathy from me. Entertainment. That's something. So what's it gonna be? Are you gonna spill your guts to me? Or am I gonna let my friend the maniac back in here for some playtime? Silus. She's a maniac. Silent maniac. Maniac. Huh? Have it your way. Come on back in. I think he misses you. Oh, and let me check you for weapons one more time. For your safety as well as his. Yeah, buddy. You hit like a bedridden old woman. Okay. Lucky you. You could borrow my dentures and I knock out all your teeth. Out. It'll take more than that to get me to talk, worm. Yeah. Yeah. You really suck at fighting, you. Just saying. You're lucky my unarm isn't upgraded. You'll be dead by now. You son of a bitch. He really doesn't want to fight. You suck at fighting. I like that. The freaking sheath, dude. You like jazz? Yeah? Oh my god. He really doesn't want to fight back. Ugh. You suck, dude. Come. Oh my god. Can you at least hit me? You're not gonna hit me? Oh my god. It's so much blood. You like that? You like jazz? Yeah. Come on. Enough. This is pointless. I'm dead to the Legion either way. I'll tell you what I know. But you Good. should know that Kaisar has always kept his own counsel. He never reveals anything that would make him vulnerable. My knowledge will not prevent the inevitable. 
This camp will be ash within months. Maybe weeks. Be judge of that. Let's hear what you gotta say. Something is wrong with Kaisar. Something he is attempting to hide from his men. But it was obvious before we set out on this last mission. For three days we awaited his order to dispatch us. Three days. But he hid in his tent, refusing to give orders, complaining of headaches. Okay. He looks different now than he used to. His face is sunken, sickly. But any questioning of his health enrages him. Okay, there must be more you could tell me. There is one other thing that may interest you. I know that Kaisar has planted a spy here. Every night, details of NCR troops. Oh, you mean the guy already caught? From a radio on this base to Kaisar's camp. The spy has been here a long time, since before the entire conflict began. He's an officer. If I knew who he was, I would tell you. If I escape and he's alive to report it, the Legion would hunt me down. But like I said, none of this information will change the outcome for you. No force can hold back the tide of the Legion. Yeah, yeah, whatever you say, buddy. Where'd she go? That was fun to watch. I'd have you do it again, but I'd probably get in trouble. This will do the NCR a lot of good, so you should be proud. Here's the standard fee. Plus, I threw in the price of a good show on the strip. That's for me personally. You can beat up my prisoners anytime. Oh my god. She's great. Alright, anything else I could do around here before we call it today? We'll talk to the main leader too. There is that. I say we save that for next time, but it looks pretty big. Let's talk to the main dude. Boone, are you gonna give me your quest? Yes, what is it? How things for the NCR around here? Could be better, I'll say that much. We set up here with our sights set on annexing New Vegas. It's a lot of resources that could do a lot of good for us. But that hasn't happened. If anything, they annexed us. They rake in the profits from our soldiers and we're stuck protecting them from the Legion. Not exactly the plan. What does that leave you? Now we're trying to secure the strip and the dam at the same time, and it's costing us. And in the meantime, General Oliver won't approve any offensive maneuvers because he doesn't want to risk losing our positions. So we're in a holding pattern here. And Caesar's on the other side of the river, planning. Okay. What's Cam McCarran the role? It's our main base. We took it because it lets us keep an eye on the strip, and it had already been fortified before the Great War. From here, we handle most of the logistics for our operations in Nevada. Troop allocation, supply distribution, intel. Usually, General Oliver runs the show here. But he's on his way to the dam now, so I've taken on a lot of his duties here. Okay. I think it's mostly quiet between here and the dam. And unfortunately, no. In fact, the word from the ranger stations has been especially concerning lately. It sounds like they've run into overwhelming resistance, and supplies just aren't reaching them. It's been so bad, I asked Sergeant Reyes at Camp Forlorn hope to look into it, and see how it is that things could be so fouled up there. All right. Okay, well, I guess that's what we'll call it for today. Hi, Boone. You made good progress. Uh, we got the camera carried finally. We found a weird sewer that I never knew existed until today. And next time we'll explore the concourse. I have no idea what's in the concourse exactly. And then we'll finally go to New Vegas and explore New Vegas and do crap in New Vegas. Uh, what else? Yeah, we could go to the medical. Yeah, there's a bunch we could do in New Vegas. So we'll probably enter Freeside and mess around here if we can. There's still a bunch of stuff left to find. I know that. There's this here. There's that. I know what that is actually. I remember what that is. Hello. Yeah, we did really good today. We make good progress, and we'll continue on Friday. That was fun. The katana's overpowered. I love it, and I hope there's another mod for it, but I don't know. And yeah, we got the chainsaw. So yeah, that'll be it for today. We'll continue Friday trying to make as much progress as we can. So, bye-bye for now.